I'd say both of these fellas are oh, like, either yeah. of these guys can make it in grand finals, and I wouldn't be surprised. We got Mr. Oh. J on your right, Cobb on your left. No, no, Mr. J's on the left, not the right. I'm playing a match. Hold up. <laughs> okay, so I guess right it's. Wait. Yeah. Okay. So I guess it's just me at the moment. Uh. Okay. Sorry. So Perfidious Sin is stepping out, but Virtuous CGP is still here. For Tekken, no, for Tekken Seven. We've had a. This game has had a pretty good lifespan. We've added some new. We've got some. Yeah. We got Lydia recent. Yep. And then we got, yeah, we got Lydia a couple months ago, and it's good to see that tournaments are still happening in spite of everything going on. Lots of good stuff. And, of course, Tekken and Sebus is always a treat because we've got so many talented players. We sure do. We've got, and... We have one of them, Mr. J, stepping up right now. Yes, Mr. J is easily, like, in all of our, of all our talk, uh, Tekken players we have, he is easily in the top five. Easily. He's one of the guys that anytime... The, all the times that Cle the Cleveland guys would come in and there'd be the Cleveland versus Columbus matches, he was usually like one of our guys to go in and say, hey, Columbus rules, take that. Also, before we continue, continue with anything, big, 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 big thank you to the Kyle Keister, the Keist, for hosting this amazing event with 28 games, including Lego speed building. That was- Goodness gracious. Uh, hey, am, no. I on, am I on, Matt? Oh, yeah. okay. Probably just can't hear myself very well. Yeah, so we've got... Which one's me? I turn myself up. Turn up for... Oh, that, okay, that's probably enough. Yep. That'll do. All right. All right. Yeah, one of the things that I think has helped Mr. J out a lot is he plays Master Raven and yes. plays them very well. So you have a character that's not nearly as common with a few hidden tricks. And that, you know, that match of knowledge thing is always... It's always an advantage if you got it. And up against a more orthodox character, Jin Kazuma. Somebody they say Jin. Arctic Snowfall. Huh? Jin me. No. No, no, no. no, no, no. Uh, uh, Jin is not a Mishima. Jin is a Ka Kazama. And well, they're, they're well, point. I mean, he is a Mishima, but whatever. Okay, yeah. let's just let's just get into the match. Mr. Che getting a nice start here. Got some good flips going. Really getting Great in. Low poke. Not really giving Cobb a chance to do anything. Oh, never mind. As soon as I say it. Great Oki. I'm a tear's curse. Got some good uh, Korean backdash action going on. You can definitely tell these are two people that know what they're doing because a lot of this match is going to be just them. Wow, great duck underneath oh, the high. Yeah, seriously. Just everybody, it's, it's a big game of fishing. Yeah, there's going to be a lot of movement, a lot of with oh. punish fishing. Yeah. And then a lot of counter hit fishing, which I'm pretty sure that was a counter hit there that uh, the Cobb just got. Yeah, nice one there for Cobb. But Mr. J ain't out of this yet. Looks like Mr. J's really good with the low pokes because that 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 crouching low goes way further than I than you think. Fantastic low pair. Oh yeah. Sir, yeah, you can tell in that round Jay was just he's trying to force things a little bit more. I mean, okay, we're back to more typical movies. Beautiful. Oh, there we go. Yeah, we just kind of throws it out there, and he he just ha he just knows when to bite. Oh man, nice another nice one from Cobb. The counter Maven's hit. got rage. Mm -hmm. Yep. A lot of good movement here. Mm -hmm. Just Both. a simple poke, no with punish. Yeah. Sometimes that's really all you need in a game like this. You just need that one good moment, and bam, you're set. I gotta say, it's kind of throwing me off playing this after a whole bunch of Virtual Fighter, mostly because yeah. in Tekken everybody has the same weight, so you could do a oh, combo. Oh yeah, could, that's right. Yeah, cause no oh, seven golden letters, seven golden letters. I wonder what uh, Mr. J is going to do to adjust to this. Right now he's going to stage select. Yeah. I wonder if he wants something with walls. I wonder if he wants a breakable floor. Probably, or maybe. Oh, he's, he's picking a smaller violet, stage. He's going to Violet Systems, which has walls. Yeah, that's interesting. Yeah, that's that's one of the things I love about 3D fighters is, well, I mean, uh, this applies to some 2D fighters as well, but more so in 3D, is how much the stage joints really matters. Yeah. Um, it oh. matters to the extent that uh, Soul Calibur, Soul Calibur's, uh, Soul Calibur ended up adding uh, a stage selection rule to its, uh, to its online tour. Oh, yeah. 
Yeah, and it's it's identical to Tekken's, I believe. Yeah, and then a couple virtual fighter tournaments, including ones I've hosted, started doing that as well, just because of how important it really is. Alrighty. So like, it's gonna be any any good hit's going to take them to the wall. That's, oh, that's totally. how the size of this stage tends to matter. And plus, both these characters get some really good combos. Okay, Jay's being a bit more aggressive, really trying yes, to get really in there. Yeah, he needs to because he was he was doing mostly non-committal poking, whereas it was Cobb who was making decisions. He was making he was taking the initiative to make things happen. Oh yeah, and Mr. Jay needs to do much more of that. Mm -hmm. Oh wow, he blocked and punished that that crouching poke. I think that's gonna get right to the wall. Ball Absolutely. splat. Yeah. Bam, bam, bam. Nice. Oh, good recovery by Mr. Jay. Nice block. Nice low there. I think that's like oh, the... Oh, what a trade. That's like the hardest thing, I think, going from being a new player to a hardcore player is knowing... You, so when you start off playing, you want to be super... Parry. You want to be super aggressive because you just want to push buttons. Then when you get better, you want to be super defensive because you know that's the right way to go. But then when two top players are playing, they're both super defensive, and then you're like, okay, I got to do some fishing. Yeah, they're using, they're using mostly... But there's a lot of safe counter hit uh, fishing going on here. Hmm. Nice, and, nice by Cobb. Not yeah. intimidated by that flip. No, because, well, she can't block during that, so... Yeah, but I know, I know some players, like, when a, when a character has a flip like that, like Raven's there, or, like, some of the moves Chloe does, sometimes the animation Fantastic seems so bizarre there. that you don't know what to do, and you just don't try to attack because you don't know what's up. Goes to show that Cobb actually probably knows the matchup to a decent degree, which is helpful. I a would lot. say so, yeah. Mm -hmm. Ooh, good little stutter there. Nice. Stuttering crouch from Mr. J to try and condition some sort of response. Yeah. Oh, man. Missed electric. Oh, nice grab. Ow. It looked like her so foot. Maven's got rage. She needs to, you know, dead. Maven and needs to make more use of her rage. Mm hmm. Yeah, that is definitely something. I haven't seen. Well, I saw Jay do one rage attack. But that was it. I'm kind of amazed he didn't try to use it because a lot well, of the he's best. Probably, he's probably looking for an opportunity that's just not presenting itself. I would imagine Cobb seems like he's playing very, very safe. Oh, yeah. You can tell he's got a lot of confidence in this. But I'm also pretty sure for both of these players, a lot of their matches today were the first offline matches in a while. So oh, yeah. I know. Uh, when Actually, I... uh, Mr. J traveled to a tournament, I think, relatively recently. Oh, yeah. Yeah, like I know for a lot of tournament. players today, this That's is... That's death, the... by the way. Nice. Nice by Mr. J. I know for a lot of people, they're like, okay, I got to get the online timing out of my system for yeah. this. Yeah, oh, yeah. This is my first uh, off big offline tournament, like, you know, since the before times. Yeah, same here. So it was really good. I hosted, like, a five bazillion online tournaments, and it's good to play in person. Oh, absolutely. And some games, they need it so badly. Oh, yeah. Because Tekken is one is of just... them. Well, Tekken's at least in a better situation than Soul Calibur is. Oh, yeah. Oh, nice flip. By, that's one of my favorite things about Master Raven, just using that, in, I don't know what it's called, invisibility, but getting through. That, that's the yep. thing that makes Raven enter. One of the... I know I tend to use, like, non-typical terms for archetype. Favorites. Uh, <laughs> Mr. J. Nice. For, uh, for character archetypes, like... Well, okay, I know a lot of them, but the one I like to use for characters like... Raven. I call Raven a quote-unquote tricky character because a lot of their moves you can tell are not directly inspired by martial arts, like the weird flips. Raven is not as tricky as Yoshimitsu, but, but yeah, she but is still very unorthodox. Yeah, that's what I think. Like characters like Raven, like Yoshimitsu, like Chloe to a degree, their style is, seems to be a mix of martial arts and like dance or acrobatics, which you know that's the thing about coming into Ooh, fighting games is if you have out the poke. If you know a lot about martial arts, there's a lot you can kind of get a feel for. Like, even if you've just watched, like, martial arts movies or read books, you can still kind of get a feel for what someone like Jin might do because his, his style is mostly based in reality, mostly. He's getting, too, he's getting so many counter hits in this match. Yeah. Like, because it looks like Mr. J is getting kind of antsy in wanting to poke out even in the middle of, in the middle of strings. Which Maybe. is oftentimes a sort of call out because some oftentimes pressure is comprised of ending strings early. Oh yeah, and totally. He's just, he's just being wrong on these call outs. I think he's what a, a with punish. He's a little. I don't want know what phrase to use, but like maybe frazzled. Frazzled. Yeah, because he's lost these matches and he's like, I gotta get in something. Right. And so, 
Cobb found that poke, got some advantage, and threw out another another oh. jab to finish it off. Frame advantage tends to be pretty heavy in Tekken. Oh, yeah. It's, it's quite significant. It is. Let him move it. Oh, oh the tar the that, that duck. My, my goodness. All right, we're at the point where, you know, both players know what's close to the end, and both just got to make sure they know what they're doing. The, these are the most... Like, a lot of people think the most hype moments in fighting games are, like, when supers wow. are getting thrown everywhere. And I'm like, no way, man. It's when two guys have, like, equally good movement and defense, and they're both just looking for that perfect poke. That's what I live for. Oh, no. Oh, oh, oh jeez. Oh, he blocked be... that. Oh, my gosh. What a good block. Oh, man. This is close. This is. Oh. Great oh. Wave drive. Okay. With the right combo, he can at least take most of the life away. Oh, that's good. That's really good. Okay. What's oh, for breakfast? Oh, 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 oh my goodness. Oh, my goodness. I almost got it with the low. Less than 10 seconds. Oh, my goodness. Oh, Fantastic this is close. Jay, Jay, Jay's got a slide in there. Oh! <laughs> oh my God! I'm sorry oh, for peeking the mic there, but oh my gosh! Oh man! That was. <laughs> Goodness, yeah, I heard that pop in my ears. Though. Yeah, sorry about that. That was that was probably me. That I can't I can't believe Cobb reacted to that whip. That was so good. That was. That was an amazing reaction on Cobb's part. Okay, who needs another cup of coffee after that? Because that was intense. It looks like Perfidious wow. Sin is looking to get back on the mic. I am uh, I'm happy to let him take over. <laughs> yeah, Perfidi all right. Perfidious Sin is back on the mic. That was a heck of a match. That was, yeah, that, that last moment right there, as I was saying before he came back on, my, I think the most hype moments in any fighting game are when you have two players with, like, equal defensive capabilities and both are just dancing around each other just looking for that perfect poke. I love that so much. Like, Yeah, those guys' defense is incredible. Both and you, you see that in a lot of games, not just Tekken, but, like, in 3D fighters especially when there's sidestepping around and back and forth and you're just like, oh. I love me a good sidestep hop kick, I tell you what. Oh, the Ryan yeah. H special. Oh. Oh, nice. Twin Turbo, you say? In Subway Wang? I'm not familiar with uh, with Twin Turbo. Have you have you ever seen them play before? No, but I've 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 played Wang a good number of times. He's one of the guys that very. Uh, I know what I said. Just and roll I don't through care. it. Just roll through it. Ah. <laughs> uh, Subway Wang is. He will be player one. He's in the blue chair. Yeah, Wang is one of the guys that kept knocking me out of a lot of locals back when I was competing in Tekken. So, yes, he's a, so I personally don't mind if he gets the floor wiped with him. He's a he's been traveling all over the place right now. Actually, he's been kind of on a world tour. I saw him. He was just at a you know NYC Tekken has their monthly tournament. He yeah, was, he was just up there last nice. week. So he's been a, a long time Leo main. He's just been really drilled down on like honing and, and practicing his Leo. He's like I, one of the best Leo players yeah. out. I, I wonder if he bumped into my friend Tanisha up there. Tanisha Jane, she's the host of a group called Ladies Night FGC and they do a lot of Tekken action. Up in NYC? Yeah, that's that's very possible. Oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, she's based out of NYC and then a lot of player, a lot of the popular lady players of Tekken like uh, Cuddlecore and Sharpie tend to play with them. So gotcha. that's really cool. Yeah, shout out to Ladies Night and NYC Tekken. But yeah. We got New York Zone. He's not really from New York, but we're going to call him that. Yeah. New York Zone, Subway Wang. I believe he's on player one here. I mean, I mean, there's plenty of subways in New York, so that makes sense. You right. He might <laughs> have, I don't know if he's from New York. Out, but, I, uh, I have no idea. Probably not. But anyway, I think uh, Twin Turbo is going to be on the Kunimitsu. He, I did see him putting in some more on Kunimitsu earlier. Did you see when Kunimitsu, the second trailer, debuted that piece of artwork that uh, – which is Sawano did with the ninja moms of fighting games. Oh, yeah, yeah. That was so game. great. I love some Richard Sawano art. Yeah, Sawano is amazing. But I love that piece in particular because you're like, oh, yeah, the, the big, the top, you know, Virtua Fighter, Tekken, and uh, Soul Calibur each have ninja moms. That's kind of amazing. Chicks, yeah. So we got Subway Wang on the Leo and Twin Turbo on the Kunimitsu. Yeah. This is going to be. This is going to be fun. Bash, Bashi Shwan versus Ninjutsu. Got a lot of evasive techniques from both of these characters coming out. And we got this stage that I hate. Me and, <laughs> me and Subway Wang were just talking about, man, we keep getting the stage on random. We do not like this stage at all. Yeah, this I've never liked, different stage I've never liked the aesthetic or the music of this one, yeah, and I don't know why. If you're slightly colorblind, it's GG's, because it's all red. Oh, man. I can only imagine. Anyways, ooh, nice start from Twin Turbo. Gets a good combo going. Nice movement. He might hit the wall here. Okay, no, he just decides to keep it short. Oh. Side switches. I don't know if he meant to do that. I was about to say, you better be careful if 
Uh, Leo jump gets up quickly. Oh, good wall splat. Oh, man. With the flip over Oki, that's very dangerous. You gotta watch how you wake up there. Mm-hmm. Gonna keep it safe on the pokes here. Yeah. Oh, armor move. It's gonna get oh, punished, yeah. yeah. Yeah, Subway was really going in there, but Turbo was just being nice and patient. Goes for a teleport mix up again and the oh, back yeah. turn break dance. Oh, yeah, she's got so many mixes. Yeah, kind of a, what I like to call a tricky character for their style. Their style is based, like, not entirely in martial arts. There's hints of, like, dance or acrobatics in there, which make them tough to follow. Like, Kunimi, like in Tekken, it's it's Kunimitsu, Master Raven, and Yoshimitsu, of course, all fit into that category. I just like breakdancing moves always look cool. Oh, games. yeah. I go for more. Ooh, oh, yeah, definitely. Especially, especially after... Um, which Yakuza introduced breakdance fighting? Was That, that just was a breaker style in Yakuza 0. That was in 0. Yeah, yeah. Another reason we need to have Majima put into a fighting game. Dude, I would love Majima in uh, Virtual Fighter. Don't oh, heck sense. yes. Or Sega just needs to make a new Fighter's Mega Mix right now. But anyways, back back to Tekken. Okay, so Subway has the life advantage, but Turbo's had some yeah, oh, really wow. good mix-up. Oh, nice use of Rick. Woohoo! Wow. Yeah. Turbo's right. really, been really, really patient. They just have, like... Twin Turbo's punishers have been very awesome. Oh, yeah, the most amazing, really good punishes. He, he's playing, like, a... Oh, no whiff punish there. It's fine. Yeah. Like, his style right now reminds me of, like, how... You know how Frank Sinatra will, like, kind of create that tension with his voice, not singing, like, at his full range, and then the big moment comes and he really goes for it? Oh, yeah. That, that's kind of how Turbo's playing right now. It's so cool. Yeah, Turbo's turning it up for sure. Subway Wayne's keeping it pretty safe. They're pretty oh. even on life. Nice, nice ball. Oh, wow. Okay, Ooh. he still picks up the wall combo, even though he dropped it. American reset. The NYC reset from Subway Wang from NYC. Yep. Nice Braji Schwan right there. Oh, but he accidentally put himself Ooh. in the corner. This is going to suck. He's going to want to switch, corner switch immediately. Oh, no. oh, Rage got blocked. Oh, oh, you see that unblockable? That was, he saw that it was, too. that it was, was almost coming. Oh, oh, this is interesting. Lucky. This is, oh, oh, wow. Is that it? I think that's it. That's definitely it. Woo! That down four two is such good range. All right. Clean sweep by Turbo in the first yes. game. Change the stage. Yes. 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 I will say, while I do want uh, Subway to get knocked out because he's the one that would always knock me out of our Tekken brackets, I like watching Leo because Leo is, you know, practices ba practices Baji Schwan like Akira and Virtua Fighter does. So I recognize most of the moves that she does. And there's not a lot of Leo players anymore. I feel like the character is not very popular now. Uh, which in, is a shame because Leo season, is so cool. In season one, she was very, very good, and she, but she's got continually nerfed to the point where people are just like, yeah. It takes a lot more work to play Leo, but I still think she's an extremely yeah. Character. Balancing and uh, balancing and Tekken, I think, has always been interesting. It's at least it wasn't as bad as like when Street Fighter in the five in the early days. Some of the changes they make to the balance just made you wonder if they were just rolling dice. Right. But still, Leo still a very good character. Kuni is very strong too. Hasn't really oh, yeah. got very many nerfs. I think she's probably one of considered one of the top five or ten characters in the game. Oh yeah, Ooh, and we're and we're fighting on the geese stage, which is one of the most epic ever in Tekken. If you oh yeah, the one stage with like actual probably practical touch of death combos. Oh of yeah, oh yeah, the walls, the, the floor. It's it's so cool. I love this stage. I like Subway Wang not deciding to not finish the string there. <laughs> Safe. Ooh, yep. Ooh. And a big launcher. Yeah, that slide's very punishable. That's a, that's He's gonna got die a, for that. All right, all right. Subway finally gets around here. Oh yeah, he did lose a little. He did get no round brown, but it didn't. Yeah. Let, it doesn't let him phase him. Oh yeah. That down forward too. It's so good. Yeah, it is just. Oh my god. It reaches from from here to New York City, where Subway Wang is from. <laughs> New start spreading the news. Oh, nice unblockable <laughs> bang. Oh, Turbo is just go. Dang. Seven golden letters. Seven golden letters. When Turbo's going ham right now. Exactly. Got that Yoshimitsu unblock. Yeah, down for two. It's really hard to punish. Oh man. Mix up stance. Okay. You can't punish that knife. Yeah, it doesn't look like it. Ooh. Oh no, he's gonna get hit oh. for that. Yeah. He's a little too far out of the clean hit range for this one. Yeah. That puts that boy right in rage though. Yeah. With just, I think. Yeah. Yeah. With Leo style. I'm pretty sure if if Subway can get Rage, a Rage combo, I'm sure that'll be it. Yeah, one more hit and the Rage combo will do it, but can you get the hit is the problem. Oh, yeah, that, that's the, 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 the classic question. Oh, no, he wasted it. That's good. Big plus frames on the wall, oh, though. Oh, 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 that could be it if he plays his cards right, except oh, he did it. Oh, my God. Oh, the oh! That's unfortunate. That was, that was, oh, my gosh. Uh, Slipped away. That was, 
Oh, I don't have... get discouraged though. He can still bring this yeah, back. Yeah, exactly. Leo's got all the tools to make it happen. Big yeah. sweep. Bit... Yeah, and he's a lot, and it works. Pushing turbo towards the breakable walls. So could get something out of it. All right, that or... was unsafe. Oh, never mind. Ooh, yeah. He Ow. He, he, I think he got thrown out of an animation there, so he couldn't break it. It's all good though. Yeah, keeps it simple. Doesn't go for a mix. But he has to go in. Turn turbo has a life lead. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, punches it down for two this time. It wasn't you're not gonna give me you're not gonna hit me with a banana in the tailpipe twice. Oh. Oh, that hits low. That's cheap. This character might be cheap. I don't know if he's seen. Oh. Yeah. Oh uh, no, he oh, drops no, it. Oh. oh. That it's was unfortunate. He wasn't ready for the side wall splat. Unfortunately, dropped the combo. That was. But uh, twin turbo. Kunimitsu is taking it further through. Yep. That was. Is that still winner's side? I believe yeah. so. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so at least Subway will have a chance to redeem himself. And he's, he's fairly deep in the bracket. He can bring it back. Mm -hmm. Yeah, Te Tekken was the lo had the most. In well, did it have the most interest? It's either this or Smash that had the most. Smash typically. Smash typically has the most. Well, of course. <laughs> Let's be is. honest here. Any tournament we're at with Smash, it's going to have the most entrance. But we had a good amount for Guilty Gear, really good turnout for uh, Under Night and Birth. Yeah. I think there was 22 for melee before certain people couldn't make it, so that was still pretty good. Nice, nice. The fact that we were able to get some nice, a nice-sized tournaments despite everything going on at this makes me very happy. Oh yeah, we're we're reminiscing right now because this is the final the final event of the night. Tekken is the uh, it's the main event here, and you got to go to bed after this because it's uh, it's probably past your bedtime. Uh, not for me. I work the night shift, so. Oof. Yeah. It's yes. past my bedtime. I'm old. <laughs> <laughs> you said it, not me. It's true, though. It is the Matt, uh, Matt is trying to go, Matt and Ola are uh, Matt and Ola. Sorry, Matt and Travis <laughs> have a discussion on who's actually the old one. <laughs> but oh, yeah. I think that's just the hobby of everybody in their late twenties to early thirties arguing about who's actually the oldest. Yeah, and then you have someone like Copy who's like didn't he just turn forty recently? No way. That's 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 cap. There's no way he's that old. Yeah. <laughs> well Yeah, there's no way he's that old. <laughs> but yeah. I keep thinking he's younger than he actually. Er, I keep thinking, looking at him, he's younger than he actually is. But like, you know, people like him will come up and be like, "That's cute." When we argue over who's actually the oldest. <laughs> <laughs> Ooh, good match coming up here. Oh yeah. We got Hoodie, the Giga Specialist, versus oh. uh, Mr. J. So both people, both players playing more. I wouldn't say unusual. Well, I'd say Raven's more unusual than Gigas. But then again, Gigas kind of dropped in popularity after Marduk came around. Honestly, they're both not that popular. Like, especially, well, Gigas got some good buffs, but I still think he's, if you look at the stats, he's like one of the bottom five picked, or picked, yeah. or bottom five win rate or I, whatever. I specifically remember when Marduk was released, a lot of people are like, like, you know that meme where Andy drops Woody and he's like, I don't want to play, <laughs> play with you, you anymore. anymore. Yeah, and it, and it was dropping Gigas in favor of Marduk. <laughs> yes. Now, um, uh, Hoodie, does, Hoodie does have a Marduk. He, he, uh, he put in a lot of practice with that character, but he's a Gigas specialist. I don't expect him to pick anybody but Gigas. Or maybe, he'll, or maybe he'll do it just to surprise us. His Gigas is very strong, though. Okay, we got Mr. J. Mr. J plays like five characters, but Master Raven is Raven. basically his main. Uh huh. I've only ever seen him play Raven, and his Raven is great. Okay, yeah, he's kind of like he's kind of a scholar of the game. He plays a little bit of everything, but Raven is his his, his main chicken. His bread and butter. Faux show. Sure. Mm hmm. So so are we saying Mr. Uh, Jay's from? Isn't he from? Is he from Columbus? I feel like he's from a different. Just outside Columbus. He does the travel a little bit. I think it's at least hour drive, but yeah. Yeah, he's yeah. Close enough where he'll come to every Columbus event. Oh, 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 of course. Take all of our money. <laughs> we'll, we'll just say he's the one from New York, the city this time. <laughs> yeah, all right. Mr. J hailing from New York City. <laughs> Gets hoodie. It, Columbus is own. Let's go. Yeah. And playing on, uh, oh, the Fukuram stage. This yeah, is I love this cool stage. Breakable wall and breakable floor. And a really, <laughs> and a really, and a really cool track, too. Oh, just, yeah, this, this song bangs. I love this Yeah. Song. It's funny, I tip. I really don't care for the Tekken 7 soundtrack very much, but this is one of the tracks that I'm like, ah, this is really good. Here's something you gotta look out for for Gigas. Best 10 frame Punisher in the Oh, game. yeah. That one, two, it does so much damage, knocks down, wall splats. It's like a Swiss Army knife. Yeah. It's so good. Nice taunts there from Hoodie. Uh, Jay feels, okay, lots of defensive Ooh, movement. Big whiff, at least he doesn't get launched for it, but that Ooh, hurts. That's close, oh, oh that's it. Yeah, he Jay left. seems like he's doing a bit better than he did last time, not quite as tense, really able to get in. Probably he's just more familiar with this matchup, and that's why he's able to do better against Hoodie here. Sure. Nice, nice flip, oh, oh, wow, that tracked him. Okay, he must have pressed a button. He's gonna go to the wall here. 
Oh, oh Ooh, that wall bounce. What Look at this damage. Sheesh. That sucks to get hit by. Yeah. Oh, he's dead. He's dead. He's super dead. Seven golden letters. Seven golden letters. That 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 throw does a ton of damage, and it does more damage when it hits the wall. It's it's like almost fifty percent. Yeah, I I hate fighting the big hit be hitting characters for that reason because they always have that kind of thing. Shoot, not speaking, just in Tekken. Speaking of big hits, Hoodie just almost lost all of his life off one combo. Seven golden letters. <laughs> perfect for seven a perfect golden okay. letters. Yeah, everybody's getting perfect into that. Yeah. Yeah, Master Raven, her wall combo. Oh, big block, but he does He could probably got to go. Could've yeah, better punish. he could have definitely done something. Uh, that that taunt. The, it's very hard to approach him when he does that. It's armored, oh. and he has, like, really fast recovery. Oh! Thing is, lows break armor. <laughs> so, Mr. He, J is... He um, knows what to do. He's intimately familiar with that. Oh, good wish punish, though. On the down two launch. He's got to get out of this pressure here. Oh, oh, this is close. This could be this could be game one for Mr. J. I wonder if Hoodie can get his rage drive off. That could, that could yeah, if he gets his yeah, if Hoodie gets his rage drive, then then that's it. Yeah, that can get one. Oh, uh, I was about to say one good hit from either player will do it, and that was the one good hit. Yeah, Gig is uh, he's one of the weaker characters in the game, but he does have one of the best rage drives. Like, oh yeah, he can completely turn it around off of one rage that, drive. I gotta say though, that green color is hilarious because to me. He looks like Hulk wearing a helmet, but he forgot pants. Yeah, he does look like the Hulk, so I like that color. Yes. And, uh, sorry, Hoodie is, is, pick, is doing a, a stage select, picking a bad stage on purpose. Probably. Maybe Mr. J is colorblind. He's trying to blind him with his all-red stage. Or maybe he's just, or maybe he's thinking this is the hottest stage. I was gonna. I was waiting for Matt to throw something at me when I said that. <laughs> All right. Okay. Redstone and fire. Oh, Hoodie just went in right for it. Okay. It. Yeah. You can tell he's being the aggressor here because he he knows he's got to get something in. But he's got a good life lead now, so he hasn't got hit. Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. Master Raven does have some good mix. Yep. Yeah. She nice. has a lot of highs that don't look like highs, so you just get hit and you're just like, oh man, I could have ducked. Oh yeah. Good launcher though. You might put her in a, I think she's in rage now. Yep. So watch out for that knee. Just taunting, waiting for her to come in. Matt, he, I think Matt, he wants her to waste the rage drive. Yeah, May, Ma, Ma, Master Raven, watch out for that knee. Uh, oh. All right, forward two. Oh, wow, he could have punished that. He wasn't ready, though. It's fine. This is one hit away. Hoodie what? is not even in rage yet. He's got a very commanding lead. Jay's just trying there to get, ah, uh, Jay was just trying game. to get something. Keep it simple. K-A-S-S. Keep it simple, stupid. Let's go. <laughs> that works. Oh, man. Chops the legs. Big plus frames on that. Gigas is just, like, coated in plus frames, man. It's, it's hard to yeah sometimes. It is. Ooh, break dance. Okay, the 50-50. I like it. Yep, Jay's got the life lead here. Being a bit more aggro. Oh, oh no. That, that uh, armor. Oh, nice. Yeah, he's a little bit too slow on a forward, too. Oh, look at how much damage that That was wow. crazy. I mean, Hoodie's in rage, so that... Is that a whiff punish? No. Oh. Okay. I saw what he was going for there, but Master Raven's recovery is a little too fast. Yeah, that was... That rage would have been it, but it wasn't. Oh, it doesn't even... He knocks him on the Goliath setup. Mr. J's like... He sees where he needs to go on offense now. Yeah. All right, Goliath's nice. back just to keep it safe. Nice defensive play here. Hoodie just going for it. Ooh, counter hit knee, though. He might hit the wall. I want to hit the wall against her. Oh, it's going to hurt. Look at the damage. Who, who, who? He's on fire! Boom shakalaka! Cut it short to not leave him in rage, though. That was smart. Ooh, nice throw break. I like it, though, because he, even with the throw break, he switched sides. So I guess it doesn't matter now. Yeah. They're both back in neutral. All righty. This could be it. Hoodie could be going home. All right, everybody, everybody start doing your... Um, Raise your if, hoodies. Raise your hoodies. If, if you're cheering for hoodie, everybody do your spirit bombs right now. Put your hoodies in the chat. Is there a hoodie emoji? I don't think so. Is there not like a sweatshirt emoji? Just just put just put hashtag hoodie in the chat and spam it. Matchstick is looking at me like, what are you talking about? <laughs> but then again, when is he not doing that to one of us? Let's be real here. For real. Very true. All right. Raven had a nice combo here. Ooh. Ooh what he has, rage, what he has a nice life lead. lead. Oh, oh, that Oh, the crap. running tackle. The secret moves. The, oh, the tackle, man. no jutsu. Okay. This, this could be... Big oh. sweep. The online tactics. Oh, my He's God. He's not going to hit the wall, but it'll be close. Oh, oh no. That, oh, oh, man. That... that 
That was a lot. Oh, oh, and another. Blocks low with the wall. Why'd you do that, sir? Oh my God. Oh, nice teleport yeah, out. Yeah, the parry. I like that. J Jay's kind of in trouble, but I'm sure with the rage, they good. Oh, oh well, hoodie's dang, turning dang, up now. Dang. Oh, and the low. Turning up the heat. All right. That was. That was. That was just. That was a match. <laughs> that was a match. It's like, get me off this stage. I can't see a darn thing. <laughs> it's so red. Hoodie's been, Hoodie's been, he's, he's told me when we were playing that he, that he feels pretty nervous. I, I think he puts a lot of pressure on himself to do well. But, oh, yeah. Which is good, you know, but you got to, like. Be realistic with yourself. Yeah, you got to, like, temper your, exp use, use the pressure to, like, push yourself forward, but don't let it overcome you. Yeah, I had to, when I said I was going to retire for reals this time, which I officially took back today, it was mostly because I had put too much pressure on myself for so long and was like, I need to stop doing this. It's good to have a little bit of pressure, but not. Oh too much. yeah, exactly. All right. So now we are one-one. This is a first of two, by the way. Losers going home. Oh. One, one's gonna drown their sorrows at oh, the coffee. Oh, big counter hit! I like that. Oh, yeah. <laughs> going yeah. to Denny's. Dude, Denny sounds so good right now. It could go for some eggs. Mm. Oh. Good duck. And Mr. J could go for a good combo, and he's got it right here to the wall. He yes. The wall. He's dead. I think that's it. He's dead. Yeah. yeah. Woo! Nice. Nice wall carry, the Good wall splat. for sure. Mm -hmm. Oh, oh right, right, right off the, the start. Bat. I think Jay knew Hoodie was going to try to be a bit more aggressive at the start of that round, so he's just like, yeah, I'm going to take advantage of that. Oh, nice unblockable. Oh, man, that was that was like almost two-thirds. Oh, I think the launch oh. is going to hurt. Hoodie, Hoodie is not going to drop. Look how much damage. That, it, the thing about that combo is it resets in the end, so it does more damage than it should. Sheesh. <laughs> it really hurts. No. Oh. That, oh man, that I think. Oh man, all right, Mr. J said I ain't going to Denny's, baby. This is my match. Yeah. Oh, he's really saying it right now. Oh, nice by hoodie. Oh my gosh. Ooh. I like the crouch dash to the down forward one. Okay, we're getting we're pretty close. Oh, oh not quite the to the though. wall, but so close. Yeah, Gigas has their short little legs. It makes the combos drop on him occasionally. Oh my goodness. Oh, spaghetti all over. Everybody's dropping. I think he's, that's it. Yeah. That is it. Nice by Mr. J. He is he survives in the bracket. Yeah, Mr. J really turned it up that last game. But uh, yeah. two one, hoodie's out of here. Mr. J is going on. All right, hoodie gets to try to drive home in the OSU game traffic. No, 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 no. We're staying. <laughs> <laughs> I know. I'm. I'm I don't just... care. <laughs> yeah, I ain't dealing with that. You either gotta leave early or really late because this traffic is ridiculous. Oh my gosh, yes. I can still remember when I was trying to get into the local music scene, going to jams and the concerts that happened to be on or around the time of football games. Oh, it's oh, so terrible. That was the worst. Parking down. Even parking downtown like a normal day sucks. Oh <laughs> yeah, and then and then, and, and then yeah, and then parking on a the day of a game is just. Oh, hey, if if you do if you do that. If you do that yourself, it basically if you, basically if you are a masochist, you go try to park yeah. on the day of an OSU game just for fun. Yeah, no, good luck. Imagine I, I drove for a DoorDash for a, for a while. Okay. Trying to do DoorDash on OSU game day. Oh my. It's horrible. Oh, bet. Just sitting in traffic for hours at a time. Uh, if you want, if you want in, Jay. All right, we're gonna. I'm going to spare Matt all my terrible puns and I'll let Mr. Jay get it. Thank you, Virtua CGP. Thank you. Yeah, we got Mr. J. He's he's feeling really confident coming fresh off of. You're still in the tournament, bro. Barely surviving. <laughs> coming fresh off of his win into the commentary booth. Yeah, I'm in there. Hopefully, you can hear me okay. I sound sounds pretty good. good. Yeah, sounds good to me. I like your hat, by the way. Thank you. I love this hat. It's a nice show-off hat. My daughter actually wore it to school one day for high school, and nice. She was like, "Well, can I keep this hat?" No. <laughs> I love you. I do almost anything, but this is my hat. You can borrow it. Yeah. Yeah. You can you can hold its power for a while, but uh, you're gonna have to give that back. So yeah, we got um, we got. I've been calling Subway Wang today, New York's own Subway Wang. Because New York's own. <laughs> he was at he was randomly at NYC Tekken last week. I saw he signed up for that. Right. He's he been was, very active. And he very three active. two. So he's he's bringing that. Uh, he he told me his, his secret now before every tournament. He eats a bacon, egg, and cheese. 
<laughs> powers him up. <laughs> that's the that's the secret sauce that's right now. That's why everybody in New York's so good at tech. It's the bacon, egg, and cheese. Bacon, egg, and cheese. It's something in the bacon, egg, and cheese. Oh, I, I don't eat bacon, do, so I don't know. I can only do sixty six percent of that because I, I well for one I'm not a fan of the tea, cheese and two I got some. Uh, the old L intolerance, the lactose oh, intolerance yeah, yeah, yeah. that doesn't uh, sit well on my uh, stomach. I mean, I have that too, but I still eat eggs. So. You still do it? <laughs> oh, I still eat the eggs. Don't get me wrong. <laughs> eggs and the bacon, that's a requirement. Cheese, not so much for me. So if anybody lost respect for me, I don't care. <laughs> oh, okay, so we're waiting to get some things situated. <laughs> yeah. Might be in split screen a little bit. It looks like we got Subway Wang versus uh, the Keys. The Keys still surviving through the loser Blizzard's? side. Yeah, Subway got sent to losers by uh, Twin Turbo. Twin Turbo, yeah, I was actually commentating. With that, the Cooney Mitzel. Wait a minute, you were commentating it and you already have amnesia? Look, it's been a long day. <laughs> <laughs> you forgot people were playing Tekken? Oh no. So I think uh, I think the Keys is probably sticking on Kazumi. Yeah, Kazumi for Kazumi sure. Kazumi main for life, and then we got the Subway Wing on the Leo. One of the rare Leo mains still existing. I know, the character's gotten so good, and there's still only like three Leo players. Seriously, there, there might like be a max of five Leo players in major tournaments. And there's been some that have played Leo until other characters came out. True. Like some of them were like, ooh, Julia's finally here, or Lei is finally here. You know, Pepper Beep's too spicy, mm. one of them. Uh, there's a player out of Dayton, Micah. Um, he used to play Leo until Julia and Gani Ryu came out. The thing um, is, Leo was so popular in season one, there's so much info there for you to just still pick her up, you know? Exactly. And considering Leo got some very, very good adjustments here in season four, um, there's not many reasons not to play Leo, unless you're just, you don't like boring characters. And that's been kind of the general <laughs> consensus with this they character. They are kind of boring. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah, a little boring. I but cannot you know argue what? that. Uh, uh, definitely a powerhouse character. So here we go. Amazing Oki, too. I want to see, as soon as the keys gets knocked down, it's going to be a problem. Exactly. Subway right on top of oh, it. Good up, though. Here in the Mishima Dojo, where it all began, with one of the, the beginning members. She tried to murder her husband. We'll fly forward and back. Okay, I like that. Doing it again. I like the fly mixes. Okay, I haven't seen the keys do this before. Oh, my gosh. Just threw straight out of the hell sweep. Yeah, that was tremendous. Oh, nice. down for two. Nice way to relieve the pressure, but drops the combo. Still even on life, just past the 30 well, second mark. Punish, I believe all, basically all armor moves are punishable, right? Uh, most. Unless, unless they're highs. Uh, yeah, some of them are highs. There are very few mids. Okay, we got to run. What's this one? Stomp. Ooh, steps on his head. Damn. Had to deal with the blue stuff. Okay, hunting hawk, no go, but let's give some plus frames. All right, Subway Wang. I think he's, he's like a really momentum-based character. So once he gets started, it's, it's pretty much it's pretty much a wrap for you. And it's definitely <laughs> definitely has a character that can dictate the pace and then take turns back at will. And as always, the the dreaded back one four is always oh, yeah. on the table. Look at this it's pressure snuffing. Yeah, how are you gonna get away from the wall here? You gotta get out of here because Leo's wall damage is pretty darn good. Definitely not a place you want to be in. I feel like oh, that was hell sweet. Oh, the rising four four. It's a good recognition. Here's the hokey I was talking about. The flip over into the jump on your head, man. Showing perfectly that, you know, the crush frames are in full effect. Yeah, Leo's oak okay. is ridiculous, and that's going to pick up. That is so much damage just for a small counter hit. <laughs> they Ooh. pick up over so, over so many random hits. It's so cool. Very nuanced. Okay, we don't see a duck this time. We'd seen that before from Subway. Oh, breaks him on plus two throw. Good on stuff. Me, not on the first date. I played, uh, <laughs> I played Subway Wang. It's very hard to throw him. Got very good with his throw breaks, which is nice to see. Okay, we got an armor coming out. It's the high point. running two. Another one. No, nope, it's light. Yeah, I thought we were going to see a duology. No, oh, man. wow. You just killed yourself, sir. Bet all the M&Ms on that. So it's going to get to the wall. Ooh. Yeah, you're dead. So much damage. Subway. Clean 3 0 versus Keist. Honestly, close 3 0. <laughs> some of those rounds are looking a little scary for Subway, but uh, he brought it back. Yes. Okay, we're going to stay so, on the dojo. I, I think we're going to see a little bit of adjustment, but uh, yeah, we're just going to go right back into it. I don't blame Keys. If you've got the momentum, yeah, maybe sometimes she should keep the energy up. I think got home court advantage. She's still in the dojo. Right? Juni <laughs> Kakuto. That was good. We should we should have recorded a commercial and have you say that. That was really good. I can get deeper voices, too. So, I mean, I can go very, very deep. I, you <laughs> take that whatever way you will. Don't look at me like that, Matchstick. <laughs> matchstick. I wish we had a Matchstick cam. Right? That would be such a great expression, Cam. But speaking of shocked, look at this lively. I like the sidestep to put Subway to the, into the corner. He's just not going to give up that wall positioning. All right, down forward one, two. I thought the wall was going to splat. It was like right there. Okay. Big statue kick. Another one. Kicking them cankles. Okay. We got life out of Keist and Rage. This is a nice spot. Ooh. Dude. 
one of the best 11, 12 frame? It's easily, it, I don't, if it's not 11 frames, it's 12. That's it's a so hella good punish. That's gonna pick up a little bit, flip over Oki. Didn't believe in the punish. Still He's just staying in the middle now, no, no walls yet. He's waiting on his launch. He really wants to launch. <laughs> you called it, you so called it. I played, that damage. I played this man in enough first of 20s to know when he wants to launch. <laughs> oh, so again, going for another 3-0 sweep as Key's gonna be able to stop the bleeding here. Oh, oh it's a whips. That was Heihachi, what a hit. Easily, easily. Okay. Oh, punish the armor. Shoot, even sure. would have hit. Got the interrupt of down forward two. Nice. nice. He's definitely gonna hit the wall. Oh, so much damage from that. Yeah, he's okay. really consistent on these wall combos today. I think he wanted to sidestep, but hopped instead. Okay. Back two. He's waiting for the launch, I think. That'll do too. Doesn't need it. Just back <laughs> one four for victory. Okay. So Subway takes it cleanly. Six. Six round rounds. Straight, yeah. yeah, no round brown games. He's moving through in losers. Poke chop is uh smiling diligently up in yes, the sky. He, he summoned the spirit of poke chop for two no round brown straight. I like it. So we gotta be pretty deep in the bracket now, eh? Quarters or semis? Top four, you say? Ooh, you might be hey, uh, Me and Subway. Okay. So right. then I'll, uh, yeah, so now I got to play again. So I just got to get up now, don't I? Or is this winter finals happen right now? Okay. Oh, oh winter's finals. Okay. Ooh, still First three. Okay. Get to be comfortable. Twin Turbo versus Cobb. I'm, I've been excited to see this match all day. These guys have been have been like lighting it up. Cobb has been incredibly sharp the entire tournament. Oh yeah, he, he, definitely he not a player you want to make mistakes on. Yeah, and I I learned the hard way. I've been on the recipient of that. I've played him in first to ten, so we've we've had quite a few games, and uh, he is definitely a, a very capable Jin player. He always plays very really capable. well in tournaments for sure. Jin is a good tournament character. Now Twin Turbo, do you know anything about him? I have not seen him before today. He's from Tennessee. Tennessee boy. And if he's wearing blue, he'll win. Okay. Oh. Well, look, it's a double buff. He's wearing blue, and he's, he's in got a blue, the blue chair. chair. You know he did that on purpose. Yo. <laughs> look at that. His controller's blue, too? Hey, best things come in threes, right? Oh, dang. Uh, oh, my bad. Wrong three. My bad. We went for the wrong threesome. I see how it is. Yay. I was going to say, I mean, if we've got to talk and hug it out, dude, uh, I, I, I'll give you my support. So I'm pretty sure we're going to see Jen versus uh, Kunimitsu here. I think pretty so, because we've seen we've seen Twin Turbo really put in some work in the, the past couple of games, Kunimitsu. sending Subway to losers as oh, well. Yeah. There it is. With Kunimitsu the looking real strong. The very bright, distracting colors. I thought maybe we'd see a blue, Kuzumi, uh, a blue Kunimitsu, but... Yes, it's definitely the... Uh, it's like a Harajuku, you know... Japanese style uh, Shibuya. Somebody would definitely rock that fit in Shibuya. She looks like a The World Ends With You character. <laughs> if anybody played that game, that's a great I game. I did, I did, <laughs> I did. Played it on my DS. All right, we're going to uh, Duomo de Serio. Duo, Duomo de Serio, mi scusi, mi scusi. I love Assassin's Creed. <laughs> I don't have a problem with the stage, but you know, I, I do quite a bit of commentary in Michigan, and they hate the stage. Oh, word? They dispose of, they, they not dispose of, they despise of this as a community. They dispose of the they stage. They wish they could. They kind of do. They would flush this. They, yeah, they would flush this stage if they could. All right, Twin Turbo on Cooney versus Cobb on Jin. Let's go. So winner's finals as well, so this is going to be a long set. Three out of five. Oh. Yeah, that, that dive kick, is, it seems to be pretty hard to punish. I don't see a lot of people going for uh, The first hit of that is safe. Now, the second hit, the big show Ryukin one, that's the, that's the money. But oh, so that Tobo, kick is safe. Okay. Yeah, the kick by itself is safe. But if you get the first hit, you can confirm it to the second. So gotcha. it's a nasty launcher. Okay. That's and that's a low. One. That's so cheap. It is <laughs> fairly safe on block. You're not going to get launched for blocking it. And we've already broken the balcony. Okay. Got to reset. This is close for Oki. Oh, he stops the dash short. I like that. Just keeping the little safe. Duck. Okay. Just checking them. We're still very linear. Not much sidestepping happening yet. Yeah, I wonder if Cobb is going to get to use the race drive. He's running out of time here. Yeah, you're oh, right. The time, yeah. 12 seconds. He had to act there. The life right. lead was not in his favor. 
Fight. And that Rage Drive can do tons of damage if you, if you get it off. <laughs> yeah. Followed up mid combo or to start the combo. All right, a break dancey like that. Dang, Twin Turbo is so on point with these whiff punishes, though. Be very keen on uh, keeping keeping Cobb in check. Accidentally gives a turn back with the armor move, though. So let's see if Cobb can actually. Oh, the oh, down forward two. Running into a launcher. That's not a good way to start this first game out for Cobb. Can he has, pull it back? That thing has infinity range, man. It's very, very. Just. You can't really trust the range in which it's going to hit. Right. All right, good side step, Twin Turbo, keeping it simple. No go on the Demon Paw, so we've got a possible game one for Twin Turbo. Can Cobb come oh, back? Okay. Making the case. I like this so far to the wall. Should get a full wall combo here. Chunky damage for a trouble off a low parry, too. <gasps> oh, man. Good whiff punish. Said, watch your whiffs. Can we get a counter on screen for a down 4 2 hit? <laughs> Can we do a shot every time that happens? I'm sure we're at like three now. <gasps> unblockable. Oh, he the he unblockable. parried it. I like it. Oh, oh, counter hit down for two. That one hurts. It's going to be a lot of damage. It's going to go to the wall. To the wall. Oh, he just missed that last hit. Oh, he's going to confirm more. Nice sidestep. It doesn't splat. Oh, he, he's, he's a combo away from death, though. Okay. Is that hit low? Was that the low teleport? I couldn't even tell. The the teleport, that was the mid option. Jeez. It just it looks wonky, but it always comes out as a mid. Gotcha. But Cobb tried to make a hard read on a parry, and... Twin Turbo made him pay with something staggered. If he if he had just completely went through with that right out the gate, Cobb could have gotten that parry. But uh, if he would have launched off that parry, that would have been so that would have been sick. sick. Parry straight into Rage oh, Arms, so high up. Do it this time, Cobb. Somebody somebody go tell him to do it. He's, he's <laughs> by law required to do that now. No break. That's a one grab. You can punish this into the knife. A lot of people don't know that. Whoa! Going for the backhand. Yeah, so we got an gonna... inner inner Yoshi mixes. Look at this. Uh oh. Said, stop twisting around on me. I'll four four you in the gut, girl. <laughs> nice. Doesn't fall oh, for yeah, it. Oh, yeah, doesn't push it. Nice patience. Yeah, that move can be stepped, but it's uh, pretty difficult. Twin Turbo is not throwing out very many unsafe moves. He's just trying to keep his turn. Very keep compact. Yeah, way. very compact tech, and we're not playing at anything past range two right now. There it is to oh, confirm. Sure you can. He might be dead. Either. Oh, he's definitely dead. Absolutely. The down two extension coming out to play. Twin Turbo taking this first round, game two. Man, Twin, his defense has been so good. I don't know how Cobb's even going to get in on him. He hasn't really oh. got a solid launcher yet. No, and I mean, running into launchers, that's definitely not going to state your case better. Be well setting four. Oh, a little bit slow on a punish. He actually blocked it down four too. He didn't get to punish it for once. Very rare that you're not just getting hit by that move. But we're going to go to the wall here. Nice hook fist combo, oh. but he drops it. Yeah, he forgot to dash up. That's unfortunate. Still got a big <gasps> life lead. He should be dead, though. That's a nice combo by Cobb. Okay, we've got ourselves a match right now. Can he get a game on the board, right? right. Last thing you want to do is go down, down by two. Yeah, that's hard to come back from. But Cobb did not let the drop phase him. He's still playing just as confidently as he usually does. Keeping good, clean movement here. I like this from Cobb right now. You know, just... Being very patient, picking shots. I thought that was 4 4 going to be a counter hit. Oh! He definitely could have tail spun after that, but just didn't believe. And there's the down 4 2 rearing its ugly head again. Such a good move. We're going downstairs. Oh, yeah, we're going to break there the wall. Go. Flip the stomp? Yep. No, it misses oh, it. Oh, yeah, a little whiffy there. See, he doesn't challenge the back turn stances at all. Like, maybe he's not too familiar with what Cooney can do from that. Which is surprising because I know Cobb plays Max, and Max does indeed play Cooney. Right. Who you play is Cooney. So he plays every waifu. I think he just has, he might just have a passing understanding of Kunimitsu. Uh, I played him in a first to 10, and uh, he's fairly good with Kunimitsu. Okay, he plays I some shots pretty well. Yeah, I stand correct. <laughs> I was like, God damn, okay, Fuyu, Jesus. Nice combo to start for Cobb. Let's get this wall damage in. Ooh, ooh. Uh, juicy. Oh, I like to flip over Oki. He's around the range, though. Uh oh. Okay, these are good challenges by Cobb. This Ooh. is exactly the kind of life lead he needs. Yeah, one more hit. Is she gonna get the rage drive up? I don't think. I don't think. Yeah. Now when you're under that amount of pressure, it's hard. Just, just <laughs> keep it mid mid. I like it. Straightforward options by Cobb. So we've got tie rounds here in game number two. Yeah, Cobb's not really challenging any of the back turns up. He just doesn't want to put himself in that situation. Indeed, know? these patient situations are uh, paying dividends for him right now. Oh. Not there though. Oh, oh, demon fall to the chest. That's gonna hurt. Splat. That's exactly the kind of thing that Cobb needs, and he's yes. got one. It's 1-1. One, one. Hard life lead to come back from. 
Okay, that's definitely a, a pretty place to be now. Tied 1-1 one, one in winner's finals. Winner of this gets the chill in grand finals on the loser's side. Not loser's side, winner's side. Let's make that correction. Hey, new stage. I know Michigan's happy. Oh, you, you see, um... Azure. So Twin Turbo specifically went for an infinite stage there, eh? Uh, it would appear so. If there's one thing that uh, a lot of, of Cooney haters will, will talk about this character, <laughs> it's that she has a mad backdash. Oh, yeah. Absolutely maddening amount of capability with her dashing. Definitely so backdash for days. Maybe Twin Turbo's hoping to engage in the, the whiff punishment a little bit more. There Ooh. it is. Wow, you caught it. Do you want to tell me tomorrow's uh, lottery numbers? <laughs> Let me report stuff? the weather, too. <laughs> If I uh, take some of my cat's fur that they, you know, shed off. <gasps> nice block. First time doing the hell sweep. For real, he was ready for it, too. Okay, nice combo here into the kunai throw. He leaves him out of rage. It's smart. Okay, now he's in rage. Is he going to get the rage drive off? Now? He hasn't been able to do it the whole set. Not a bad way to go, right? He got he healthy life leap here with 30 seconds in. Gee, she's got backflips and that backdash. That's a lot. Indeed. Can very much. And then if you do up four three, she has a flip that'll change a bit of the direction as well. Gets out of a lot of mix-ups. Yes, I can see why he likes the infinite stage. She has, a, she has the movement for it. Oh, backflip's back, in the way. Backflip, back man. What are you going to do? Uh, get uppercut in the face, apparently. All right. Missing oh, out on the combo. It. That's fine. Still got a good life lead. Jin is one of those characters who can definitely sit on the life lead. Very good defensive character. There's that confirm off of the set piece. It might, it might be even on life, though, now. Yeah, pretty close. 35 seconds left. Good. I was expecting a whip punish there. Maybe can cans. Oh, definitely not one you want to whip moves on. He's, oh, oh gosh. Man, down forward two. He's down forward twos. Where are we at now? Like seven? Something like that. Seriously, we need a counter. Oh, this is hard. Even if we just get a, a pencil and paper. Do we run out of time, too? Yeah, 10 seconds left. Cooney can definitely run away forever. Look at this. It's so hard to hit her. Hell sweep doesn't oh, come the out get up so close. Oh, he's got him. yeah! Damn, two seconds left, and Cobb answers back Good emphatically. Stuff. Jeez. <laughs> it looks Wonderful. so annoying fighting this character on the stage. He just runs away forever. Indeed, and you really have to, to really place your shots, because as you see, you whiff, down 4-2 is coming for you. We for haven't sure. even seen the hop knee, up 4-3-4. Four, four. Haven't even seen that yet. All right, so when Turbo keeps it, wow, and it tracks uh, a little bit to the side. That's, that's like sucks. number 12 now. <laughs> for real. <laughs> nice chunky damage. Right, how's, okay. God, how's God going to make it up for this? He stood up. He might have had a chance to hit with the kunai. Twin Turbo seemingly inching Cobb towards Rage. Look at this life deficit again. It's going to be hard to come back even with Rage. Okay, yeah. You just... And these are the type of circumstances that have been adding up versus Cobb. Twin Turbo getting these huge life leads and making Cobb have to really work for it. Right, I think Kyle would be better served just like sit on the life lead himself because how are you going to get in on Cooney? Right, it's a very uncomfortable situation. Oh, I had the back turn. I was yeah, wondering maybe he something challenged was coming. It for once. Yeah. He usually has not been doing that. Okay. Oh, breaks the throw. Okay. Good generic throw. Get off me. That throw, it just looks like he was too heavy and she couldn't lift it. Yeah. <laughs> That's what the throw break looked like. I'm going to try it. No. <laughs> just kidding. My back out of my weight that. class, sir. Oh, he dropped the electric. A little bit of a punish off of that, okay. It's hilarious when you look at the actual weights that they give June, and they say he's like 5'11 and weighs 180 pounds. Damn. <laughs> like, look at that. There's no way. Oh, oh no. Was, Drops I don't know it. if he's going for a mix-up, trying to hit him in the back. He could have just finished it. Oh, and now no. you're going to die for it. He is totally going to die for that. No, oh, didn't he finish it with the rage art. The rage art. So calm. Sighing a huge, look at him heaving a big sigh there. Just, oh, I had it. I could have tied it up and possibly taken the lead. Cobb really, I never really see him get flustered during a set, but you could tell he was upset. Yeah, <laughs> mask or no mask, I think we all can agree. That was a, uh, a very flustering moment. All right, still 2-1, though. You're still like, it's better than being 2-0. <laughs> that's, that's all I'm saying. It's, it's true, but it's, it's hard still, on this stage. Yeah, it's very hard with this. And just going for the rematch, I don't I don't know about that. It seems like Cobb would do better with a wall stage, but true. maybe he's feeling the momentum and wants to keep fighting. I respect it. 20 seconds have gone by. No huge easy. life lead yet. We've seen the that episode before with Twin Turbo. He's trying to get in, though. Nice. Look at Orkanat. Okay. 
and this slow combo won't hurt too much, but still, now you've got an even bigger likely to make up for. All right, the 20, been reset. 20 seconds left, it's getting hard. Forward crouch, okay. All right, what's he 15 do? seconds, he's got him in rage again. This is kind of a weird fire to play with, right? Because on one end... 10 seconds. I don't know if he can win from here. Mm -hmm. He's going to have to launch him now. Right, no, it's not yeah, happening. It's, that's it, that's a timeout. This really trying, yep, up full, up three options. A little too late. Right idea, too little, too late. So Cobb, playing with his food a little bit, just letting the timer run out. Oh, first hell sleep hits. Thought maybe he'd stand up there. Small little damage off the hell sweep. Tried to force him over. Okay. Nice. So doesn't fall for it. This is a nice place to start for Cobb. Good thing Cobb saw play with that Punisher, too. Duck on the second hit. 20 seconds. We've got a very different story here right now. The yeah, Twin Turbo, this, he, he's not, this isn't the situation he wants to be in. He's usually the one with the life lead running away. Right. He's continuing to back away. I don't I don't know if it's just a, a style, perhaps, but... Oh, yeah, that's yeah. not going to Getting hooked right in the mouth. So when Twin Turbo is down on life lead, it seems like he doesn't know how really to get in. <gasps> the backstab. Oh. This is the first time we've seen a back turn mix-up. That hurts. Still has a screw available? Wow. That is mad damage. This is where Damn. now. This is what I talked about. This is where he wants to be. <laughs> Kuni Mitsu with the keep out moves. He can definitely time him out. Oh man! But it might what be even tremendous. on life after this. Look at that. He caught him out of the mix, but doesn't tail spin him. That was a perfect chance. No, he's oh, got he's it. Dead. Damn. Cobb stated the case, and he's going to tie this up. What's Twin Turbo going to answer with? Yeah, it's looking like a two-two from here to me. That throw break is, is definitely indicative that this could swing either way. So she has a real throw mix-up, right? She has a throws for every break? No. None for two, but she does have one for one and then one for one plus two. Okay. Better than this, but not like, oh, that hurts. Yeah, not what you would call a, a complete throw game, but semi, right? Good, good damage, Ooh. not the kunai throw at range. What this is, is hard. this, Street Fighter? This is hard. How's he going to get in? Got the hook. Oh, oh good pick up. I didn't even know you could pick up off of that. That was a nasty combo. So Cobb tried to be ambitious, but Twin managing to pay and pay for the mistake. This right. is the last chance for Cobb. Oh, unblockable? Just in neutral? Like that? <laughs> Guess it's time to throw everything in the kitchen sink. Yeah, this, this is where I like when when it's the last round, people start pulling out stuff they haven't brought up the whole set before. <laughs> so this is like where Matterhorn makes its ugly. Oh, head hell appearance. yeah. <laughs> Unfortunately, all the lilies in this tournament are dead. We all died. They all passed away. <laughs> oh, no he doesn't punch. get the punch on the down forward, too. He might have been a little too far away. He tried to parry Cobb. Maybe trying to force things a little too much. 30 seconds. Turbo does have a life lead. Okay, we got to punish that time. And I think Cobb has a life lead. Oh, now it's back to Turbo. Final round. Look at this timer now, 20 seconds. Ooh, my heart is beating. Bro, I don't know if I can take this. No, oh, no break. This is bad. Barely the life lead. He doesn't punish the knife. <gasps> oh, and it picks up. He's dead. Yes, we got a timer going to final game. Yes, 2-2. Two, two. What a tremendous way to pick that up. I think he's going to keep it. <laughs> he's going to keep the same stage, though, or he's going to go to another infinite. If, yeah, infinite stage. Yeah, we're rematching really well. Exactly, and while we've seen Cobb make these adjustments, it's definitely clear that Twin Turbo can run away with this for sure. There are some characters in that game where, where they can just like move away from you so well that the infinite stage really like Eddie is what I think of immediately. Absolutely, he just back dashes forever. You know, like Eddie, uh, Aly Alyssa, yes. Safina, right? These are all characters with great movement. Kuni is right up there wow. at the top. Wow, just dodges the lightning. Just... Ugh. Oh getting punched in the kidney, but we got another down four, too. That's like number 27, right? Yep, and here's Twin Turbo with the life lead where he wants to be. Now he just runs away. Ooh. Oh, good reversal. He's going to break the arm, I think. What you doing, girl? I'm like being on top. <laughs> this is a very one-sided relationship between these two. Misses the hook. Nice block on the low. Oh, oh, wow. Well, he definitely has a life lead now. Cobb definitely coming alive oh. here. Combo drops, man. Okay, okay. We got mozzarella string cheese in here. <laughs> No marinara. I like this so far. Cobb takes his first round. Oh, wow. He's really getting caught with all these throws today, huh? Yeah, the one break's adding up. All right, he gets punished on that. Nice. <gasps> oh, Damn. Doesn't launch at that time. But yeah, we've seen him do it before, but he gets himself a little correct answer and a drop again. Something's better than nothing. Any what you ducking for? This could be the round. It's going to be very close. 
Very close, yeah. He's making Twin Turbo very uncomfortable. Ooh, the three on the head. So, man, what a turnaround from the start of this set. You wouldn't have sure. think Cobb would be here from the first two games that happened. He's really turning it up now. Twin. Oof, he just lets that rip. Yes. That's going to be a huge likely. On a very, very tough side of this uh, this particular match right now, down by two rounds in the final game. And look, he's in the sweet spot where he's just out of rage where one launcher will kill him. He doesn't get rage, so. I don't know if Twin Turbo's that type of player, though. He might just run away. Oof. Uh, getting launched like that. So this won't put him in in almost, oh, they're almost even on life again. 30 seconds left. He could have pulled in the again. throw. He knows the throws are working. He can do more throws if he wants. Yeah, that one throw has not been broken at all. One plus two. I, you know what? I actually don't know if any have been broken this this whole entire set. I think he broke the one, but yeah. For, it's like 99% success rate at this point. So he can one. definitely keep throwing. Might as well. Okay, that option not stepped. Tough one, especially in this moment. Nerves might come into play. Oh, no punish. Well-intentioned hook. I would have got hit by it. Got just the extension I to like try to check break. Just, just try to bait him out there. It's a comfortable life lead for Twin Turbo. That's where he wants to be. Just outside of rage. <gasps> oh, what a hell of a trade. Of that. If they had not traded, Twin Turbo would have killed that sooner, but it doesn't matter. Okay. Final round. Final, final round. Double Luigi incoming. Who you Winner got? It's going to grand finals. Loser goes down to the basement. Wait, we're all in the we're basement. We're already at the basement. My bad. <laughs> yeah, you go to the sub basement. It's the oh, creepy God. one with all the steam pipes and stuff. Yeah, Mick Foley's down there. Yeah. <laughs> the Loch Ness Monster has been known to visit. There's that the throws. Throw. They yeah. keep, he's keep doing them. They're adding up big time. With the sidestep again. Didn't think it was going to miss, though. Twin Turbo's getting un unnaturally aggressive. <laughs> okay. So that Twin Turbo, went, yeah, that he puts it by, away. Yeah, he went, went by a lot faster than I expected. He got a lot, a lot more aggressive. I like that. It was a nice late-game rally, too, to, to finish it out, because Cobb was really making the case that he oh, yeah. could take this and go chill in grand finals, winner's side. So Twin Turbo seals the coffin. Very, very close match. Very good uh, games between those two. So I think that does it for me, because now I've got to... I've got to play against Subway. Oh, that's going to be a good match. Four. Yeah. I'm not. I'm going to be completely unbiased. I'm just excited to see that match. It's going to be really good. Hell yeah. <laughs> well, thank you for commentating with me. It's always a pleasure. Oh, thank you. I will catch you guys later. And good luck to Mr. J and the rest of the tournament here. Here it comes. We got Mr. J versus Subway. Am I solo? Am I solo commentating? Matt, can I hear you, Matt? Maybe you can go tap him. That's Mr. J. He used to be there. Gotcha. Oh, we got Tiz coming in. All right, awesome. Hello. Tiz, I have several questions to ask you. Several questions to ask me specifically, huh? What's your favorite thing about Lily? Uh, <laughs> let's side, soul caliber sidesteps. Yes, she has good sidesteps. We're just, um, Matt, I, I'm afraid to, to tell you, we're not going to talk about the game. We're just going to talk about Lily for the next however uh, I long like, this I lasts. like the, uh, she's got like the biggest flowiest skirt in the game. It's a good skirt. Have you seen, we've got that one priest. <laughs> a lot of what? One? 35 well, nice people. They're online. They probably play Lily too. Uh, <laughs> What were you about to say? Oh, yeah. She's got that one custom uh, costume with, like, a really big skirt. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 That's, I always run that one. Like that one. Yeah, it's fantastic. Makes has a good effect when you hold that uh, forward, forward, one plus two. Yeah, the spinny thing. I yeah. Um, so, I, no, we're actually going to commentate the match. But <laughs> yeah, we will, eventually. Is this, two? Uh, is this first to two? This will probably be... Is it first to two? Oh, it's so a semi, so that I would Okay, yeah, sense. they're still in semi. So we got Mr. J right. on your left and Subway Wang on your right, I believe. Both, both friends of mine. <laughs> I believe it's going to be a Master Raven versus a Leo. Uh, we haven't really seen him play anything else today, so. Yeah. Probably a safe bet. And uh, both of them are friends of mine, so it's going to be sad to see one of them lose. <laughs> oh, yeah, loser's going home, eh? Well, loser's, loser's not here, not, not playing this game anymore. <laughs> <laughs> right. We're all going home. <laughs> true, true, true. I mean, probably not till later because the traffic's so horrible. Is it really that bad right now? Dude, it's it's so bad. I guess I'm 
I guess I'm walking. It started to... at seven. Oh man, I thought it ended at seven thirty. I guess bummed. I'll be walking to wherever I'm eating dinner tonight. Yeah. <laughs> Watched the Bayonetta tra- three trailer a few times. So excited! I I bet that Cereza from Bayonetta one, mm-hmm. except in like the timeline that was made when. Whoa when whoa Bayonetta whoa whoa whoa! Okay, I was totally oh. wrong. That is not Leo. That is Claudio. It is Claudio? I didn't know that Subway Wang had a Claudio. Maybe he just doesn't like Leo in this matchup. That could be. That could very well be. So we're gonna see a whole bunch of FF two here. That's that's very possible. I've seen like I've I've been noticing more people picking up like a separate character just for specific matchups. Yeah. Even though Tekken is one of those games where you usually just like main one character forever. Yeah, yeah. It's not it's not so deterministic like some two D fighters are. Right. Like particularly Fantasy Strike, which is why Fantasy Strike has to be run in team battle format. Gotcha. Um, but I I mean like I can definitely still see some matchups being pretty difficult in, in this game. Yeah, we got Subway Lang on the Claudio. Okay, let's see what he has. Ooh. Ooh, what punishes the FF2? Yeah, a little bit too short. That thing has infinity range, but not infinity plus one, unfortunately. That's right. Ooh, and the counter hit's going to take him out. I really like this Master Raven custom. Yes. Er- looks very slick. Claudio's not so much. He looks like an Elvis in person. He, yeah, he looks... <laughs> he does, actually. I'm sitting here like, what? what does Claudio look like right now? Like a cowboy or no? Definitely cowboy Elvis vibes from this. <laughs> it's the weekly yes. enemy stand user. Oh wow! Okay. I got I'm just gonna flicker over here and I got hit too. Punch you in the <laughs> yeah exactly. All right, back to yeah, Claudio. The one of his biggest strengths is he has a lot of really good homing moves. Yes. Like the. Like that uh, side step three, uh, back two, a lot of good homing stuff. So it's hard to step him. That was a safe uh, safe high there. All right, he's finally got Starburst. Starburst. Big plus frames. She still challenges, though, with the ultimate tackle. And now Starburst is gone. Oh, yeah. Oh, but he drops it. I guess he's not. drop. That's the thing where, like, if, you, if you've been playing one character all tournament, you switch to another, you're yeah. not fully warmed up. That, it, that can happen, yeah. So that's what I think is going on in Subway Wang, but he's still doing okay. He's got a life lead. Hazen, oh, it's Especially in Tekken, you don't have a whole lot of room for error in your execution when it comes to Tekken. For real. Doesn't finish the string, I like it. Oh. Great right. grab. All right, just eight seconds left. What's he gonna do here? Oh, gosh. oh he doesn't whiff punish! Goofy oh. ass evasions. I wonder if he's gonna switch to the Leo or if he just really does. Yeah, Leo, uh, we, we are we're going back to character select screen. I think you're right. I think we're gonna see Leo. Yeah, it could just it could have just been a thing where like he doesn't like the matchup, so he switched to Claudio, but now we're just gonna He's gonna go back in on the main there. Yep. So we, I think he's gonna sometimes you gotta like take the higher comfort over the bad matchup. Exactly, yeah. You doing over there okay over there, stream admin? Matchstick is moving now. Oh, turned off. Turned off my friend Perfidious Sin. Hello, hello. hello. Now Perfidious Sin is back. Is that me? Ah. Oh. Do you need me to? Do you need me to say some uh, some riddles, some tongue twisters? I'll Rubber twist baby buggy bumpers. <laughs> <laughs> itty bitty baby, itty bitty boat. I haven't heard that one. <laughs> that's that's mad old. <laughs> I don't believe it. All right, new Twinkie stage, house. new character. Oh, and sweet. We've got a decent distance to the wall here. So that you see that armor move didn't hit Leo. Actually, uh, Leo, some moves do whiff on female hurt boxes. So do they? Yeah, Master Raven's gonna have to adjust for that. It usually would hit him on the ground there. Oh right, because right, right. Leo's gender is uh, up in the air, but in terms of the hitbox, nope. Leo, Leo's got lady Whoa. hitboxes. Big running through. I like that he got around, got out of the corner here, but it's good. Subway wants to launch. One launch will do it. Oh, and Rage is off the table. Subway could still get Rage, but he just really needs one more hit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Now he's got Rage, but he just needs one more hit though. Oh, we oh, no whiff punish. Not quite away on the whiff punish. You know when I said he needed one more hit? That was it. If he I had lied. done it sooner. <laughs> All right, we're just going to keep it simple here. Big oh, side step. Goodness. Great, good crap break. Oh, yeah, that down forward, too, is, is really good. It tracks and it launches you. 
When people are on their grab breaks, they are on their grab breaks. For and real. That's, that's something you can do in Tekken versus Soul Calibur because you can see it. Right. Oh, the high, that move is so cheap. It's you high and low at the same time. What's up with that? <laughs> nice, I like that. Subway playing way more patient that, that round, and it really, uh, it really helped him. He's looking for the launch. Oh, Hell Sweep is so fast. They say it's reactable. I, don't, I feel like it's not. <laughs> <laughs> you know the funny thing about a move that hits high and low at the same time? The, the right answer is still to crouch. True. <laughs> <laughs> You're right. <laughs> Oh yeah! Oh, you can technically par you can technically punish that move. It's minus thirteen, but she can parry right after, so it's it's kind of like a it's an ambiguous situation. Mass Raven's really good at those. Oh, the Oki's still good, even though hitting the back. Oh, with the rage drive, strange. Mr. J is has had many many tirades about how bad that rage drive is. That's unfortunate. <laughs> you can occasionally see it'll it'll whiff for no reason sometimes. That looked like a no reason whiff. <laughs> it definitely was. All right, that's the air. Oof, it's a big chunky low there. Mm-hmm. It's really taking away all. It his reaches life really far too. Yes. He's been using it as a long distance poke. There's another no reason <laughs> whiff on that knee. Oh wow. Max range on that back three. Mm -hmm. Still gonna get some good damage. And a good wall positioning too. Good. Wow, what a conversion yeah, from nice just low a combo. goofy little kick. Any low parries that? Oh, that might be death? I think he might from, Um, I don't know, I think he's alive. I think he's alive with scaling still. Low parry scale a lot. Oh, wow! wow. Unless, unless. All right, one, one. Remember, this is still that, that, two. That looked like it could have fallen either way. If he right. had maybe like one or two more HP, he might have survived. This is still first to two, by the way. Losers still, still first home. to two, yeah. So we are one, one, final game. And then the winner will proceed to face, I believe, uh, was it Cobb who got set down? Yes, it was Cobb, yep. Oh, that's going to be a good game, too. It's all good games from here on. This, if, if, <laughs> if Mr. J wins this one, that'll be a run back. Yes. I didn't see that match. I think I believe it was off stream earlier, uh, Mr. J versus Cobb. Oh, no, that was on stream. I was here commentating that. Oh, dang. Okay. But still, I would, I would like to see that run back. That is a good match. Mm -hmm. But now we got the final game. Subway Wang, Mr. J. One of my friends is out of the tournament, but one of my friends is proceeding to losers finals. Subway Wang is really going, uh, going aggressive this game compared to the last one. It almost seems like ever since picking Leo, he's been dialing up the aggression gradually. Who did he play before Leo, actually? Uh, he played Cla Claudio. Okay, gotcha. So that was his previous main. Well, no, no, I mean... You're, oh, I in, the you set, meant, in the set. Yeah, I thought okay, you meant yeah, in the set. It. Yeah. Gotcha. Yeah, I was talking about this set period. <laughs> oh, he, he might be dead. Yes, the optimization, Mr. J. <laughs> Making sure you got every bit of damage out of that combo. You can punish that back three, I told you. It's hard, but you can do it. Yeah, you gotta be you gotta be on time. Well, steps on the toes, but first time we've seen that. Oh, the armored launcher, okay. That might be another thing where, again, female hurt boxes, you don't right. get a full launcher, you just get right. that Right, Leo, Leo is Eleanor Cleason. That is that is their government name, so. Right. Your government name decides your hurt boxes. <laughs> <laughs> nice. That hell sweep is so good, so fast, a lot of damage. While setting four, one plus two, very good move. Oh, you don't want the online special? Okay. Oh, good deal, Rick, too. <laughs> hey, online tactics still work offline sometimes. Yeah, occasionally. You've got to have the audacity to do it. Right, just people aren't usually used to it offline, so it'll yeah. work occasionally. And it can tilt them, too. It's like, man, I can't, I can't believe I got hit by that online stuff. Oh, man, I got I got hit by a hell sweep earlier. I was so tight. Yeah. <laughs> How does that happen? Man. <laughs> and now that you're on tilt, it's worth Ooh, trying. Big up. Great fish for that uppercut. Definitely dead. Yeah. Master Raven's wall combo damage still some of the best. In the game. So the combo wasn't even over. He was dead 10 hits ago. Yeah, for sure. <laughs> but Leo's uh, wall damage is not, not something to mess with either. Yeah, look at that. Oh, the Columbus Spring Kick, and he doesn't get punished. The Columbus <laughs> Spring Kick. The classic. Subway Wang from NYC. Right in the kidney. Still doing the Columbus Spring Kick. Oh, wow. Great punish there. 
Does he hit the Can wall? Take I think so. Oh, yeah, boy, look at yeah, that. This, this sucks. This sucks a lot for Leo. Yeah, Master Raven's wall damage is pretty good. Great pressure going Mr. on there. Mr. J might be going on. Oh, I And Mr. Like J that. proceeds I didn't even to think losers that, finals. That float would hit, but it did. Good stuff. So it will be Mr. J and Cobb for the run back. Thanks to uh, Subway Wang for coming out all the way Absolutely. from New York City. <laughs> uh, but he is out of here. And Mr. J is going on. That's a weird way to pronounce Cincinnati. <laughs> <laughs> I told I told you why he has he has the the NYC power up. He told me he eats a bacon egg and cheese before every tournament, and it helps. That's a uh, yeah. That's that's a that's a that's a ritual, huh? Got to be on a bagel. If it's on a croissant, get that shit out of here. <laughs> we don't want that. Man, all I did before coming here is eat Wendy's. <laughs> that's that's the, it's really underrated tournament tech is to not go to you don't want to go to a tournament on an empty stomach. Yeah, for but sure. But you don't want to be full. <laughs> you got to hit the happy medium. Yeah, you know? yeah, yeah, yeah. I had enough lunch to where, like, I'm not I'm not getting any shakes or anything. I'm not right, particularly right, right. hungry right now, even though I could and should eat. <laughs> I just always have, when I'm in a tournament, fanny pack full of uh, full of peanut butter crackers. That'll, that's the tech. That'll do it. That's that's some good tech. That'll right keep there. you full enough so to the point where you can focus. So I think we're in top four now, top three. This is top three. We're heading on to losers finals. Very nice. Ooh, good game. I'm, I'm looking forward to this run back. I hope I hope Mr. J wins. I really do. Hey, we got chat. Hey, chat, what's up? Got that Ekans 6 Wi-Fi. <laughs> Such a clutch set. Oh, hi, Slooch. Hey, Slooch is here. Slooch is tuning in. He, uh, he, he messaged. I don't know who told him about. Hmm? What? Oh, we're tagging okay, out. Okay, fine. I'm gone. <laughs> Bye, friends. Thank you, Tiz, for joining me on commentary. We got the keys coming in. Yep, good stuff to Mr. J's moving on. Oh, yeah, I, I can see the whole bracket from here. Wow, this is amazing. Yeah, there's not much left. But, you know. Losers final coming up. Cobb versus Mr. J. Yep, uh, third place gets 14. Oh, yeah, we're counting Second money. place gets 32. First place gets 84. Did uh, Tekken have the second most entrance oh, no. today? Third? <laughs> uh, uh, probably less than that. We're definitely behind Smash and Guilty Gear. And Uni. Get less than Uni? Dang. Shout out to Unist. Maybe even others. I haven't checked the full counts yet because I've been busy with other stuff. But a lot of D a lot of Tekken DQ'd. True, like, yeah. A lot of Tekken DQ'd. I don't blame him with the traffic down with the traffic downtown. It's like, yeah, I'm not gonna deal with that. Oh, it's because uh, <laughs> stay at home. I'll just call him out on stream now. Kevin, who you didn't know they were realized they were moving the same weekend. Oh, moving's hard though. It is. So I understand. Right. So yeah, we got the match we expected. Uh, Cobb on Jin and Mr. J on Master Raven. And our Tennessee player and Grands. Twin Turbo has been lighting it up. I'd never heard of him before today. Yeah, he's been he's, been, really he's well. been messaging me all pretty much the last like season. We'll, we'll talk about him when it's his turn. It's these guys' turn. All right. Uh, Cobb's good, and okay. Jay's good. I don't know who's going to win here. Actually, this is the rematch. Cobb two won to him earlier in winners. Okay, sent Jay to losers. So, so Mr. Jay's going to want his uh, revenge here. Whoa! Yeah. What is this outfit? Which one? <laughs> <laughs> the one that looks horrible. Which one? <laughs> <laughs> Uh, Jin looks like that looks like something Ali G would wear. I don't know if any of the kids in the chat a break. know what the Ali G show is. Oh, you didn't see Borat? Say oh, the punish! <laughs> oh, drops. Rare I'll, drop. I'll stop being distracted by by Jin's horrible outfit. Nah, you'll keep being distracted by Jin's horrible outfit. We'll have to reverse roles. I'll have to like try to somewhat commentate us through this. I guess I don't know. Oh, the back, but the oh, good wow. armor. Look at the the balls on armoring through that. We still have plenty yeah. of health. Good punish. Ooh, it hits off the ground. Good stuff from Cobb. Yeah. Oh, that was clutch. Jay almost clutched that. And. Oh, good oh, launch. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> he is playing. One of the Master Raven's biggest strengths is oh like. My. Oh, no. He oh. missed the wall combo. Yeah, one of her biggest strengths is she can whip stuff and it's like so. She recovers so fast. It basically like. Baits you into trying to whip punish her like that. Yeah, like that. Yep. <laughs> like you can't really whip punish her unless you're really on point. Very clean round. Very so, clean. Master Raven players like whiffing is a real. It's a legit strategy. Yes. 
Even some moves on block are really hard to punter, so. Like back three. Uh-huh. Like that, there you go. <laughs> cobble, cobble. Is he, is he wired in? Yeah, can you hear me? Is he cheating? Does is he have the stream? Is it really cheating if he's hearing us talk about it? Does he have the stream? <laughs> Does he just have like the stream up on his AirPods? Oh, man. Oh, the armor move, yeah, that is punishable. Yeah. Most. Good low. Oh. <laughs> he's gonna get a flow combo off of this. He might hit the wall. Yeah, it's just funny he orbitaled and he jumped. He just still got combo. Good punish on the get up kick. Ooh, big damage, look at this. Ouch. Man grabs. <gasps> Cat oh, wow, he just lets it rip. Uh, oh. Doesn't finish it, though. I think he's going for reset. He's a little yeah, I, yeah, I agree. Goes blue. Oh, good. Ooh, yeah, it keeps. You have, to, uh, you have to quack jab, then, but it's hard to tell. Gotcha. Fight. All right, still, it's still pretty close so far. Mm -hmm. I don't think anybody's got a really commanding lead. Yeah, I agree. Oh, floats him out of the air. Another demon paw for good measure. Two of them, thanks. It's so hard to commentate this because it's like, it's, well, I shouldn't say commentate, but it's, it's always hard to tell who's going to win this because, like, once if Jay gets that hit, just like here, all the damage is done. He's going to be dead. Oh, wow, you were right. Yeah. Mad. No, Master Raven does crazy wall damage, man. <laughs> Will it kill champion... Perfidious Sin commentating tonight, folks. <laughs> I'm telling you, if Master Raven hits the wall, it's going to hurt. Yeah. Oh, wow. But I like I was, that phase. He didn't get a whiff punish, unfortunately. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I was just commenting that uh, Cobb, with the like the pokes and the punishes, have been solid and stuff. But yeah, he's not getting anything major. He hasn't really got too many launchers. Yeah. Oh, he's wow. getting stuff like that, though, which is kind of nice. Okay, there we go. We got a little something here. Got a little, little shindig. Yeah, doesn't get the full wall, wall combo. Chose not to. Again. Low wall slow. Okay, maybe he chose to on purpose because that would have put him in rage. Gotcha. Yeah, he probably. So now he just needs one more thing. Like oh yeah, that's that should, it. That should do it. Yep. Kyle taking three rounds to two. You win. Rematch or a different state? I don't think he's gonna pick a different character. He's probably just taking this time. Yeah. Because it was pretty close. It was it was a close set. It was. It was just like he's, he's got to take some time to compose himself. You ready for the next one? Well, so you just thinking about another character. You got three games, you know, you can you can like breathe, brush it off. It's just mm -hmm. one game. Oh yeah, he's definitely focusing. Look at that. So focused. Oh <gasps> no, you don't do that. <laughs> we don't do that here. Uh oh, everyone in the room is shaking their head. Nope. He's I think he's looking at the crowd and everybody's ah. shaking their head too. <laughs> What a tease. <laughs> or is that what he does? He has to look at Yoshimitsu's character portrait for inspiration of how to play Raven because he's the first ninja in Tekken? Oh, yeah. It's like it's like the Dexter's Lab meme. He just has a picture of Yoshi in his locker. Yeah. I have uh, failed you. <laughs> <laughs> Chat, scream and do it. Do not. No, don't don't encourage this man. He needs to stick with, stick with his bread and butter. The, the Master Raven's putting in work today. I don't, think I've, I don't think he's picked anybody else in bracket. He ran some. Uh, oh, yeah. He usually solos Raven, I thought. Yeah, when he's playing serious. He ran right. some uh, Katharina in in friendlies, but mm. yeah. <laughs> Katharina? <laughs> Katharina. <laughs> it almost sounds like you could roll the R. Katharina. Yeah. <laughs> now we got some Master Raven oh coming Lord. up. Oh, wow. Oh, that'll get launched. That's a good start. I like that. Unfortunately, he's a little off angle. He's not going to break the wall. So yeah. This crazy wall damage, though. But... Oh, he sidestepped into the wall, though. Cobb, come on. Yeah, Cobb was a little flustered. He wasn't expecting to take that much damage right off the oh! bat. Oh! Sick overhead. Oh, he drops it. He should have got that full. He you know, Cobb's got full dropping convert. a lot. Like, I, I thought some of them were intentional, but I'm starting to think he's just dropping a lot all of a sudden. I did notice that in the set with, uh, with yeah. the turbo, yeah. Uh, will this kill Master? No, he's alive. Okay. Um, he'll have a You've heard it here, folks. Oh, he has more than a pixel, actually. Yeah, but oh, God. You, you answered the major question. Is this the unblockable? <gasps> What's happening? Where is he? Oh, he's oh, where to go? go? <laughs> <laughs> no. I don't even know if that's what he wanted. I don't know either. That was epic. I told him he was going for, So if it was the unblockable, that would have been smart because he just goes straight up and down. <laughs> I don't know if that's what he wanted. I'm going to break this wall. He's going through this. I promise. Any second now. Doesn't grab to it. He's still on the wall. He's still going through it. He might just kill him before he breaks. The tension. 
Go challenge by no, Cobb. Don't, don't step it to the wall. You need to break <laughs> the wall. Just mash the ledge. I got money on this, man. You gotta break the wall. <laughs> that was a sick uh, block into the punish there. Yeah, I like that. Yeah. He didn't break the wall, though. I'm still sad. Yeah, there, there. Look, you're good at calling like a little, a little kill, not a little break the wall. <laughs> That's true. That's they, They're only paying me for will it kill, not will it break the wall. Yeah. Ooh, full punish on that. I didn't know you could launch that, actually. Yeah, I, I definitely know it was launch punishable. I just didn't know what that moved. Oh, that's but, definitely launch another, punishable, yeah. too. Man. Mr. J's bringing it all on these big lows. Yeah, he's got, he can't do it anymore. He might. He's alive. Do you throw rock three times? He oh, did! Oh, my God. <laughs> he did. Why? He threw rock three times, and he got papered all three times. <laughs> uh, all right, they so threw the work. fourth rock. Hey, eventually it'll work. <laughs> but look at the wall damage. Yeah. Ooh, ooh, ooh. If you throw a thousand rocks, you'll win one. <laughs> Please, no more sweeps. My heart can't take it. Just do normal moves. Oh, there, there it is. Go. There's the mix up. <laughs> There's the scissors. Perfect. Oh, perfect. Bang. Very nice. He had to bring it back Gosh. after that first round. That was that was killing me. Grab this. It's master rating strategy. Whiffing moves. It's gonna whiff stuff you can't put. Look, yeah. Mm. That's hard to put. Yep, the whiff into the parry. Yeah. I like it. He's playing it really simple. Yeah, you even said it was hard to punish, too, and he tried and failed. Hey, another rock. <laughs> Please. Is that what more. we're just going to call Lowe's as rocks from now on? <laughs> yeah, every, every Mr. J Lowe is the rock. Oh, the big low. Mm -hmm. He's breaking the wall. He's going to do it. Everybody, look. Oh, no. This is why you don't get paid for no! that. No. <laughs> he didn't even break the wall. But he wins the game. It's fine. Uh, Whatever. <laughs> Alright, they got a rematch there. I guess he won. <laughs> <laughs> one more. Good old rival rock. Nothing beats that. So one one, we're keeping the same stage. We we haven't broken the balcony at all yet. I'm I'm going to be upset if they don't break it. I'm still calling. You know, I, they did, I didn't break it in my match either. Can we, uh, can we open like channel betting? Can we bet who's gonna break the wall? Because oh, I'm putting it all on Mr. J. All my channel points on Mr. That's J. A, that's a dumb bet. He, he'd be the one to break the wall anyway. Just how this <laughs> matchup works. And that's when we all lose our bets or money or just channel points. They're not uh, even more effective. Gold duelings. Fifty cryptocurrencies. <laughs> Fifty cryptocurrencies. I don't know what cryptocurrency is. Oh, oh there it is. Oh, he didn't break the wall. <laughs> they're just, they're just messing with he me. He dropped now. it. He dropped it again on the wall. They're literally just trolling me right now. I think so. Mr. J with another rock. <laughs> round two. Very clean round by Cobb. Yeah, he's. Oh, oh the back turn. Oh. Yeah, Cobb's scared to try with punishes on him all of a sudden. Like, now he did it, but that took a while. All right, they're about even on life after that one now. Like, even there, Oof. like, he, he did it, but it was still delayed. Right. And you really, you should be scared to whiff punish Master Raven, because <laughs> it's so hard. Yeah, but you have to, like, I don't know. There's times where you got to know about it, right? Oh, yeah, you can punish that. Yep, armor move. There we go. Oh, ouch. Big damage on that counter hit. Raven with rage. Goes blue. <laughs> Just do the That's a full the combo? Move. Uh, He's not knee dead, into knee. Yeah. He's totally dead. No, no, he dropped the I wall. I should have kept my first prediction. <laughs> yeah, you're about if the combo kills, and that wasn't a combo at that point. Oh, the big low. low. Oh, nice grab. Yeah, she does have a little bit of a throw mix up. Ooh. Oh, he was ready for that, but he's not going to break the wall. I like doing can cans there because it kind of tracks. And... There hey, we go. There it is. We lost all of our money because Raven didn't break the wall first. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks, Cobb. Yeah, all of your cryptocurrencies are gone. <laughs> Oh, the big break oh. dance. I like the delay on the low. You see, he took a Ghost, little extra Ghost time Rock. to make sure it hit, yeah. Oh, he paused. Rage pause. All right. Um, I'm going to... Is he going to go stage select? He might go take some more time because it's loser finals, man. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. He's going to look at Yoshimitsu's lovely... Uh, is it dreads? Technical? Or tentacles? Some uh, kind of tentacle thing, yeah. yeah. Isn't it just a hat? I don't know. He's like a cyborg. He could be a bio cyborg. Wait, is he bringing out the Cooney? Oh, snap. See oh, that? Oh, I didn't know he had a Cooney. Ah, yes. That's true. Uh, Character change from Mr. J, though. He's going Cooney Mitsu. Yeah. Why? That doesn't make sense. Oh, you nerd. 
<laughs> I'm glad the stream. I'm glad the stream didn't hear that. Boo! But he's got us there. This is what. This is why you're not on the mic. <laughs> Talk I, about I hope octopuses. the chat. I hope no one heard that on the stream. We're saying some nerd stuff about yeah, octopuses and, and Latin, <laughs> which is exactly what Kinemitsu stands for: is octopuses and Latin. That's true. <laughs> Uh, Cobb kind of opens up with a low, but I have not seen Jay play this character before. Nor have I. I know he has a Lydia, but... Oh, I uh, believe he has. I'm just saying I haven't seen him before. I've n yeah, I've never played Skinny Minza. I, uh, I believe he's good with the character, though, because he's, he's just a solid player yeah, in general. It's not right now, but I'm sure he is later. It's okay. Like, sometimes when you're switching to a character, you got to warm up. Yeah. The thing is, when somebody's already up two, it's kind of hard. So one of my hot takes is that if you're actually going to be serious about learning a character, then you swap characters every game while you practice, and people Oof. don't do that. Because that's what you have to do in a tournament if you think about it. True. The fast and blockable. Good punish by Cobb. The thing I do know about Kunimitsu is she does have a lot of Yoshimitsu gimmicks, like back turn stuff, fast mm -hmm. unblockables. We haven't seen any of them yet. Throw mix up. Oh, Cobb doesn't even finish up the forward four. What was he oh. trying there? Oh, there it is. Oh, the hop knee. All right, big damage again. Needs it. No, the, the wall supply is Oh, there. good block. Dude, Cobb's defense Cobb. is on point. This game. Cobb knows his homework with this character, the, the Kunimitsu offense. To be fair, if you play Tekken online enough, you're going to run into at least 20 Kunimitsu. That's true. Game. Hey, the... That's a full combo. There we go. Oh, yeah, okay. Yeah, you got the Yoshi spinny he... kick. Block confirmed, so he didn't continue it. See, he's going for the unblockable. He knocked him out of it. Yeah. Oh, wow. What? Both people didn't know. Oh, the, the two hits on the break dance? That was a lot of damage. Nice. Dash and mid. Cobb. Still on match point, though. Yeah, Cobb's still potentially going to grand finals. Yeah. Mr. J has a lot I of think he's going to. His momentum's pretty high here. Oof. I like Jay, but Cobb, this is a Cobb day, I think. Oh, and the hell sleep on the wall. He's got to get, yeah, he's definitely got to get away from this wall. What's he going to do? Box the launch mix up. Cobb's mm -hmm. defense has been so good this set, it's going to be like extremely hard for him to get in. Yeah, I was frustrated when I played against him earlier myself. I was like, how do I hit this guy? Exactly. The answer is you don't. Unless you're Turin Turbo, which will do that oh, later. Hard. Unless Jay gets this comeback. This is hard. Does he? No whiff punish. He has some pressure, but he's... Good pressure on that. Yeah, just poke him out of his stance. Ooh, unfortunately, he just switched, he just switched himself onto the wall there. Oh, nope. I don't know, it's a hard thing to All the pressure's it. on Mr. J. He's got 15 seconds to make this comeback. He does. Woo! There's a start. Yep, now he just needs but one launcher. Oh, no. Is oh, what's he going to do? Is going to time? No! Cobb is oh, the turn. block, and he no, doesn't good. confirm! No, if he had the right punish, he had him. He needs one more hit. It's no! Too late. It's too late. Wow, we haven't seen a timeout loss a timeout in a victory time. from Cobb. Oh, he needed one more hit. It was so close. Yeah, Cobb takes it. That is a heartbreaker. 3-1. We're going to the Grants? We're going to the Grants. I need some, I'm going to grab some water, actually. Yeah, I'm going to pay out Jay while you get water. Boom. Cool. Hey, uh, Majesty, commentate first. We're both leaving. I'll, yeah, see you tomorrow. Hopefully anybody else can hear that music. That's my jam right there. Anyway, <laughs> we're going to the grand finals. Uh, so what did you think of Twin Turbo's play earlier? Twin Turbo is extremely solid. That looked very frustrating. Yeah, I wasn't I wasn't sure where to seat him, and then I asked him his rank online, and he's like, I play a lot against Tennessee. I'm like, well, generally, if you go further south, 
Mm. You generally get closer to Atlanta. Mm. Oh, yeah. Which means you get pretty better at Tekken. So really I like seated, I seated him third. But yeah, he's, his defense, especially when we went to the infinite stage, his defensive play style, which is like, that looked extremely frustrating to play against. But yeah, he's. With that said, though. Very good defensive. Cobb player. did go 3 2 against him in winner's final. True. So oh, it's. That's true. Gives you two more now. He know. does have to win two sets. So even even if he did win that last set, uh, Twin Turbo has the advantage coming in here. Yep. And you're going you're going straight from losers final to the grands. You got no. You just already did a long set. You might have to do potentially two long sets. At so. least it wasn't that long of a set because he did three one J. But so. you know, and let's be fair. Uh, a lot of what Cop was doing was extremely safe against J. Like yeah. he didn't. He wasn't doing anything like crazy. He was more of just like what getting the blocks done. Getting simple punishes. He dropped a lot of wall stuff, which he needs to fix that in the set. Ooh, the double Mordok. <laughs> yeah. But yeah, we're probably just going to see Jin versus Cootie. Stick to your main stuff. Another Jin versus Cootie in fight. They're good characters. Yeah, I just wasn't expecting it back to back. So we got Grand Finals coming up. Twin Turbo going on the tear of Kunimitsu in, in the winter side. Cobb on the gin and loser side. He's yeah. got to win two sets to take it. Final match of Tekken 7. Final match of Kakatu or Junior Kakatu Gamo. 20 games. Power to stay at the hype stage. Let's go. It's going to take extra long to load, though, because it has all those walls. Yeah. I'm not, I'm, not making, I'm not making any bets on who's going to break the walls because it went very poorly for me that last set. <laughs> Grand finals, let's go. We all lost. <laughs> really? Except that one guy, like, oh, it's going to be good. Like, you didn't know that. <laughs> You're just being a poser. All right, grand finals coming up. All right, impressive with Twin Turbo. Let's go. It's a respectful start at the beginning. Oh, that one goes low. Nice. Oh, man, that... I, that's something I really haven't seen from a lot of Cooney Mincy players is not just she has a really good backdash, but he's also utilizing the back flip. Like the a lot of people don't really use that, but it's it's a good evasive tool. Yeah. It's been working out pretty well for him. He's already got a huge life in here. That's right, it. That's it. <laughs> but yeah, the back flip really I was good gonna say the back flip used to be countered by like the heavy wave dashing, but that's kinda nerfed in seven. Right. So it's like but yeah, look. Yeah, that's a good point. That's that's really the first time he's got punished for it. It's, it's been very oh no punish there. Well oh okay, gets the hell sweep. Let's see what it goes. All right, just goes for reset. Gotcha. <laughs> nice. That's safe, huh? Okay. Now Cobb's in the lead. Ooh. Oh wow, new stuff. Out of that dash stance, he's got a little mini launcher there. Oh wow, I can't believe that throw didn't hit. He was just <laughs> he was a millimeter out of range. It seemed like. Does it hit crouching? Because he was crouching, too. Okay, yeah. That's probably it. Yeah. Ooh! The big knife. The comeback. Twin Turbo, also, he was he was doing a lot better on the infinite stage. Ah, but, okay. Um, just because he could run away so easily. But yeah. he's, he's taking this on the, on the wall stage pretty handily. It might be what was said earlier, that Cobb might be running into the exhaustion. But it's only game one, though. So. Oh, the big uppercut. If he breaks this wall, he's dead. Yeah, he can finish his combo and kill him, for sure. Oh, oh the doctor misses oh, it. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> so quick three rounds for Twin Turbo. Wow. Yeah, very quick. I think Cobb needs to take a little bit of time. Just like he just got off that last set. He's got to take some time. Though. Yeah, I wonder if he knows that. Though. Gets his mind like, right. I think he's, I'm not going to call him like. He's, he's definitely stubborn. a vet. Is he stubborn? Is he being stubborn right no. now by rematching so fast? Wow, match rate. Max rate. I think he's a player who doesn't have a ton of grand finals experience based on where he came from. And that's, gotcha. like, one of those things where, like, if you're in the top three, then, like, you need to know when you're playing for a long period of time, you need to know when those breaks have to happen in between sets, like everyone's saying and stuff. Right. It's going to hit the wall here on this. Yeah, but he has a great lead. Cobb is, that is. Good. Oh, no break. Okay. This is that's what we're seeing in the last set. Uh, Cobb's having a lot of trouble breaking Cooney Mitsu's throws. I think, like... Probably had a 99% success rate on the throw, so. Oh! oh tried, to, tried to get the splat off. There's the punish, good. Good punish. Good clean. Really clean uncharacteristic win. of Twin Turbo to go for an unsafe move out of that stance, though. Yeah, I wonder what panicked him. Okay. 
All right, Turbo just trying to keep the lead here. Yep. Although he's being a lot more aggressive this time than he was against Jay, I've noticed. Oh, for sure. But maybe that's because Jay was just more aggressive in general, so he had to be defensive. Ooh, Hit that's the wall great. Up that one for yeah. sure. Yeah. And the full combo. Oh my. Uh, oh, oh no, he no. dropped it. That was totally the wrong combo. Oh, he jumped. Yeah, he's getting a little. I think he's getting a little flustered here. He yeah. still got. A, he still got a good life lead, but he's got to keep it together. He does. But that's a start. He ducked an electric. Yeah. Bad man. Kind of. That's a read. That's what I'm saying. If, the yeah. throws are going to be hit. Just keep there in as many throws as he wants. All right. I agree. Oh, oh no! Oh. Good duck on the throw. Oh yeah! Wow. I barely. Man. <laughs> he did it faster than I saw. That throw would have killed, but uh, that little micro duck got him out of the way. Oh, we blocked all that. Crazy. Nice. Ooh. We get it again. He's on the top of the dome. Going to hit the wall again. Don't mess up the combo. All now right. Flip over Oki. Oh, we got the reset. Ooh, yeah, the Oki. It works. That's Another so one. much damage. Dam wow. Dominant round from Kyle. Uh, yeah. Let's see more of that. See if we can get the reset. You know what's going to happen. For those at home, not sure, in case you joined later, Twin Torbo is from Tennessee. Cobb is from, lives here in Ohio, but. He's going to the, yeah, yeah this is this is where, this is where he uh, he did his best work on it. It makes stage. sense. Because Kazumi is one of those characters who can just run away forever. Okay, yeah, that's. Yeah. <laughs> oh, jeez. No, I don't want to go to Tennessee. No. Oh, see, I would like to visit. There's Nashville. But I wouldn't want to live there. Yeah, this is pr pretty much what I expected if Twin Turbo lost. He's going to go to the infinite stage where he can just... He's most comfortable playing defense, just get the life lead and run away. Yeah. <laughs> we had a lot of timeouts and near timeouts on their last Oh, good set. interrupt on the dash there from Cobb. Another good interrupt from Twin Turbo. Oh, challenges the electric. Yeah, Twin Turbo, he's just not going to put out anything unsafe on the stage. It's like he plays differently on the infinite stage. Yeah, but I was more impressed with the idea of like, I don't know if he was like doing as a select thing, but it's like he just the guy did an electric, and he's just like, now nah, I'm just gonna launch it. Right, <laughs> it's crazy. I guess it's a high. Oh, oh yeah, right idea. He's a little too slow. All right, now he's just gonna run away, like you said. Yep, he doesn't have to do anything. He's got is this, he, is he this tag? <gasps> Oof. See, and keep an eye on the timer. We've been getting their and their sets have been getting really low in the timer, like Roger that. threatening the timeout. Oh, the whiff punish. They both had the same idea, shared the, shared the same brain cell there. Oh, he dropped it. He, did, yeah, he didn't think it was going to hit. He didn't believe. That's where Twin Turbo wants, wants to be. He's going he's gonna to need to get this life lead, and he's going to keep it. I have the parry ready. Oh, oh! That looked like an input error to me. He's never done that But before. then he drops it. That's how he's going to lose. He's going to drop everything. Max range. Down <laughs> forward two. Good old kunai is. Twin Turbo looks like he, he doesn't know what to do when he doesn't have the life lead. Oh, he's not dead, but he's going to be close. He's going to have the life lead after this for sure. Go to the anime uh, animation. <gasps> Ten seconds. Eight seconds. Okay, what's the move? Oh, he's good. got the big plus frames on that. He's got, he needs one more hit. There it is. Uh, no timeout. Awesome defensive play by Cobb. There. Yeah, very great present of mine. Man. Ooh, good stuff. Just slices him. Yeah. Ooh. Man, that down forward too. He's got an insane really good. hit rate on that. Rarely gets punished. Another anime cutscene. Uh. Oh, wow, look at that back turn mix. Yeah, I'm not sure why Cobb jumped. Oh, That's okay. Like painful you need, to, you need to get this. Dropped it again. Oh, you jinxed him. And the throws. Like I was saying, yeah. he's not breaking the not throws breaking at throws, all. He's not breaking throws, not doing combos. Round four. Honestly, if, if Cobb wins at this point, it's going to be Twin Turbo's fault. Yeah, I think so. By <laughs> giving it to him. All right, Ooh, here we go. Trick. Let's see if he finishes it. Oh, somersault, new stuff. Very good punish on the down four two there. Oh, the oh. can can! <laughs> He's like, why are you spinning around for it? Yeah. Just waiting for him to come down and punish him for it. Like, that has to be intentional now. And I don't know. I don't know. No, no. I don't know why he's not doing more. I guess unless it's the rage. Oh, very good sidestep from Cobb though. 
Okay. Rage online. What's the move? Uh -oh. oh, big uppercut. And again, we're getting low on the time, under 20 seconds. Yeah, but I don't think that's going to be a thing this time. The unblockable oh, the tackle. tackle! And then can't punish it. Oh, just a little poke. Ah. Twin turbo going up 2-1. I think he's... he's oh, that's oh, just going to rematch. It's not that's, gonna a serve, mistake. that's not going to serve him well. Now, that's something I could lecture on for hours, the whole, like, stage mentality stuff. So this it's is like something the Smashers have down. Dude, this like, is twin turbo stage. Like, he exactly. definitely should have switched off this stage. Exactly. If someone counterpicks there and you don't care about the stage, you take them off that stage. Right. Become and then you go to, and then more specifically, you go to a stage you like. Right. Even now, if it's technically not good for the matchup. Perfect. Good punish off of that, yeah. Mm hmm. Yeah, that right. might, have made, might have made a huge mistake by not changing the stage. I right? think so. See, you he see, uh, Twin Turbo's getting a lot more aggressive now with the mix-ups. Yeah, and he can because he's like he's on the you know match point essentially. Right. So, Rage to Gen is scary though. I haven't seen much blue. Oh, he punishes the armor there. Good not stuff. that he needs to. The rage damage is enough. Oh, the grabs! Oh, he broke. Oh, he broke. Oh, he broke. Okay, okay, okay. We got it. Got breaks. Yeah, he would have been dead off of that. Oh, they got got. All right, here we go. The true match. The verge of winning is really turning up the aggression here. Relying on Kunimitsu does have. She's a good keep away character, but she also has insane mix-ups, especially the back turn stance. Oh, she jabs him out of it though. Okay, he's mm -hmm. seeing through the holes. Chop away the legs. Now Jin has a life bleed. Oh, he doesn't punch that though. Down for a two is punishable. <gasps> No break, break. But other than to be fair, he was in the middle of a move, so it's yeah, hard to break. Yeah, I think he just threw him out of the move, so yeah. that's fair. Ooh, challenges. If this is a launch? Yeah, good pickup. Yeah, I mean, I'm cool if he's trying to drop it there, but man. Now Cobb's got the life lead. Yeah, but you know what? He had the life lead before. In other sets, I mean. The throw, man. The throws are killing him. He got scared. Go. He's got one more hit. One turbo's going to take it. There it is. There it is. The that's the end of the tournament. Wow. Congratulations to Twin Turbo taking it, going out in the grand finals without missing a set. Amazing. Good stuff to Twin Turbo. Good stuff to Cobb in second place there. That was some good Tekken. Yeah, that was. What kind of Twin Turbos run real quick? Did he go to losers at all? I think he was winners all the way no, through. No, he, he did. Yeah, yeah. he was. Good stuff. Really good tournament run from him. Oh, I seeded him second. Awesome. Okay. That's only one place left. That makes sense. <laughs> I don't know what seeding is, but that sounds right. Yeah, you can look at the bracket and actually see, like, I had J as one, Torgo's two, and that stuff. So, good stuff. Kuni so, yeah. terrorizing the lands once again. Right, so that concludes Juni Kakatu Gemo. All 20 events finished. Uh, I don't remember exact entrant count because we were they were calculating that while it was before I came here and stuff because we had a lot of no shows and unfortunately, uh, I'm sorry. Luckily, Smash GG has the awesome ability where if someone is um, already in an event that they've been DQ'd in, you mm. cannot remove them as an attendee period or anything. So it kind of like makes numbers hard to add up. And that stuff, so. is confusing. Yeah. <laughs> um, I guess they wanted in case they paid venue or something, but pretty much Smash. In long story short, Smash GG is made for majors, not for other anything not a major so it's like that's right, where yeah. confusion stuff that's gets fair. into place so um but yeah uh i think we had like probably roughly 130 a day is my guess okay based on the amount of dq so we were coming into this event with 152 and then had so, a lot of people not show up and stuff. but that just happens over uh, 100 i say that's a success yeah and this, <laughs> actually awesome 130 still time. makes it the highest running cockatoo so good good show on that despite it being you know covid times and all that fun stuff and then, uh, yeah, shout-outs to Matchstick for streaming. Shout-outs for Maniki Gaming for streaming. Shout-outs to all my staff that ran each of the, all the games and stuff. And even shout-outs to the staff who couldn't make it, but, you know, they helped out in their own ways, too, um, before the event and stuff. Uh, definitely shout-outs to the guys that came out of town, like the Twin Turbo who just won this from Tennessee. We had yeah, players from Texas stuff. fly in. We got yeah, players from Chicago time. drive over and stuff. And, um, yeah, the uh, – and then my next – this will be the last cock until we do 20 games until the FGC has been like rebuilt in the area. Mm -hmm. uh, the next cock is going to be on December 4th, which is CEO weekend, unfortunately, but I'm going to be running. December. Yes. Oh, that's today. 
Well, not today. <laughs> what? December's not today. Yeah, keep going. Yeah, that's what I thought. Close enough. Close enough. It's on, okay, on September 26th. <laughs> Three hours from now, we start the next cocktail. We start it all over today. again. Yeah, I invite everyone back. And, uh, <laughs> uh, yeah, December 4th. Um, I don't know the game list yet. It kind of depends on who's able to, like, actually come and do stuff. But the ones I want to do for sure is uh, P+. Plus. Uh, Brawl and Nick Brawl. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's coming out pretty soon. Right? Yeah, yeah, coming out in two weeks and stuff. So, yep. Uh, anything, any other links anyone else you want to say? Uh, and the shout outs to Coffee Underground, one of the best venues, if not the best venue in Columbus. Yep, shout out to Coffee Underground. Shout out to Matchsticks for streaming, the Keist, yeah. co, co commentating with me. And running this thing. Oh. And running this thing. <laughs> 20, 20 games in one day is pretty insane. I think it would pretty, it would single win about yeah, as, yeah, well we, as it could. Yeah, we, we just had problems with DQs because uh, people, we were looking for people who weren't here. Looking right. for ghosts. So, you all have a good night, and uh, Matchstick will close you guys out then. Watch Isaac in. All right.